Alô? Alô, alô? Alô, alô? Alô, alô? Hello? Um, alô? I was on phone with me mom. Well, hello. Uh, I have a confession to make, Waza. Give me a second. Give me a second. Give me a second. I'll show you. I'll show you. I'll show you. <laughs> I'll show you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever, whatever, whatever. Log me in. Whatever, whatever. Oh! <laughs> it's time for a checkup. Oh, uh, who's that? Oh, uh, you know what happened? I did two single pulls and I skipped them because I was like, yeah, whatever. I have two tickets. And I don't want to have two tickets because that's not satisfying. So I skipped them. And you know what? Who was in there? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yeah, her. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yep. And I don't know what she does. I don't know anything. It's time for a check. Okay, sorry. I, okay. See, she's mean to me. See, what am I supposed to do with that, huh? But yeah, uh, so so we're dealing with that situation, I guess. <laughs> uh, I was like, I was staring at her and she looked at me and I was like, what the fuck did you just do? I did like, I did a single pull. What the hell? Um, what is this? Why is this show this new house huh? stop? And here I have two pulls again because there's the, the, the login, right? And you get, you get pulls. Uh, I don't even know. Um, anyway, anyway, I have her now. I don't know what she can do, but I have her. And I think she's she's probably good in a, like, she's probably actually good with baby blue. I think if you want, like, a, a blue team, what is this? this just to be yeah, sure. yeah, yeah, whatever. Uh, but yes, welcome in, everybody. Hi. Um, we're not, we're not doing Gamba today. We're not doing God much today because my game just thought, hey, you know what? Yeah, hey, whatever, whatever, whatever. Give me that. Give me that. Um, and I still have like a lot of rolls. Well, a lot, right? I have 8,200, which is, I don't know how many rolls. Uh, for for Jessica. Jessica! Uh, Jessica is the, the deer girl. For some reason, I named her Jessica, I guess. And she, I don't think, she wasn't named Jessica, right? She was named Changeling, and then they, they, they changed her into Jessica for some reason, but yeah. Um, but yeah, 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 we're, uh, we're chilling. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, so, so I have her, I don't even need to do this anymore. Very, very nice, actually. Very ni now I can, now I can roll on her. I think Voyager is such a pretty unit, like, look at her. Um, but yes, uh, we're gonna do more story today. <laughs> We're going to do more story today. I don't even know where we're at. Uh, I did some. I I did some of the hard. Um, not here, I think. Not non. I mean, some. I I did some because I needed them for the materials, I think. Uh, but yes, I I did that. I'm cleaning up a little bit. I'm trying to do. I tried to do this as well. But it, I think it reset, right? It resets weekly, right? I'm not high. I think it reset. Um, what is this? I don't freaking know. Uh, but yes, and I'm trying to do all of these as well. But I, yeah, I, you know. Um, but we're gonna do my story again. I think we're. I think I think we're almost done with this question mark. With 13, how long are these chapters usually? Yeah, 15, 16. We're kind of getting there. And then we can do the last chapter. And I think that's the last one that is out as well, right? Uh, but yes, uh, let me just say hi to everyone before we start. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, hi, Source, and welcome in, Kieran. Welcome in, welcome in. Uh, I thought I, I saw you I think follow or uh, something I saw something at some point I think it was a follow uh, <laughs> and I remember your name but yes welcome in and hi Izzy and hi Cypher and hi Dar and hi Morph uh, and hi Waza hello hello mm, and hi Sai hello good day good day <laughs> cute mode let's go and hi Psy hello Hello, hello. I hope everyone's doing well. 
Um, she's best healer in game, cleanses this damage and applies crit wound. If you do first part of the event fully, you can I-3 uh, I here for free. Oh, that's really good. She's good with Lilia, Regulus, most non-greedy DPS. Uh, Voyager is a baby bloom, ba baby blue upgrade. Uh, I want to roll on it, but it's like, it you know, it's kind of dumb because it's just a standard rate up. And I want Jessica. Jessica, my beloved. Um, yeah, so I don't know. I don't know. I I'll probably get Voyager at some point. I don't know. Doesn't matter. Watch the opening to the event. True, we could do that. You're right. Uh, can someone tell me how many chapters this one has? How many chapters does the third the third thingy ha has have uh, have? Uh, Hi, Kyrie. Hello. Hello, hello. I sleep for ten hours. What? 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 That's what I do daily, huh? <laughs> I actually didn't sleep that much today. I'm a little bit EP, but I'm like a good level of EP when I'm EP enough, but not too EP. I'm more energized. Like I'm more I'm, I I talk more and stream I think, <laughs> which is really like con it it contradicts itself but it, it's you know I don't know what it is I I get a little silly I think. Hello, how are you guys doing? I eat for ten hours today too. See see that's good though. That's good. That's a good thing. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Well, I hope you're not, like, dead, because I know some people, when they sleep too... I mean, if you sleep too long, that's also not good. I hope it's, like, a good 10 hours and not a, oh, uh, you know, <laughs> we, you know, I'm, I'm dead 10 hours, because I know some people have, you know, have that where they sleep too long and then they kind of struggle a lot. Uh, 17 to 20. Mm, I don't know if we can fit... I mean, if it's just... Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Also, let me just check the game audio again because I feel like... I feel like I want to put it a little lower again. It's... I know, I know, I know. Where do I do this? I'll keep it the same amount for you guys, though. 40, 40? I need to lower it. It's way too loud for me. I can up it for you guys, though. How about this? Is that good? I feel like not much happened, to be honest. I feel like not much changed. Um, I'm usually ultra dead if I sleep for 10 hours, but I'm feeling pretty great. That's good then. Yeah, it's like it, it's not good if you sleep not if you don't sleep enough, and if you sleep too much, that can also be bad for you. Yeah. Um. Event story was really good. There is again text not aligning to voice actors. Oh, and a lot of gauge. Hello, that's good. Song is chugging enough to see an engine combat. Yeah, I can make it lo a little louder for you guys, but um, yeah, I don't know. We can do this. We can we can do this. We can look at this because I haven't looked at this actually, and it's probably very interesting. Oh no. Oh no! Why is it so crunchy? Why is the quality so crunchy? That was a night in 1971. A night with pouring rain. Oh my god. In that rain, the communication okay, maybe center it's a of low. Zeno lost contact with the Green Lake campsite. But wasn't it a story? I am kind of attracted indeed. To women? Yeah. Staying here is really not a wise choice for you. It's our right to stay here. You can't just expel us. Someone is passing messages to us through these notes. We have been with a butcher whose identity is unknown to all of us. Like the story of Xeno Youth Force. We are in real danger now. Oh no! Um... Um. <laughs> um. Lonnie? Lonnie? What is happening? Hide and seek. This is not funny. The critters are multiplying. Things are getting worse. Oh, 
She's fucking scary. I don't know what you want me to tell you. Oh my god. This is giving me Stranger Things vibes. And I don't like Stranger Things anymore, unfortunately. Oh my god. <laughs> Jesus Christ. And uh, they need to like change their menus or something because... What is all of this? This is so confusing. Why is the upper left one not the one that's unlocked first? Dude, the vibing. Hold up, I'll, I'll increase the audio for you again. Hold up, hold up. I know, I'll, I'll, we'll, we'll get back to it, don't worry. It's too loud for me though, but I'll, I'll, I'll ruin my ears for you. It's fine, it's okay. <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. Here. And now we, 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 we vibe. Let's go. It's like kind of in my ears. It's a really weird sound. <laughs> it's really good. I agree. It's a really good. It's a jammer. Duh. Bottom right opening part of the event. Yeah. Yeah, I have to do it, but I don't think I'll do it on the stream. I think we're good. Your sacrifice appreciate this streamer. Uh, it's, it's actually not that bad. It used to be much, much worse, but I kind of found a good level. It's just in combat. I don't hear myself, and that is weird to me because then I don't know how loud to speak, I guess. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Oh, on the right is main event part about two fairy. Oh, here, right? Oh, and this is Jessica. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Second half of patch. Okay. All right. Yeah, I can see that. Dun, 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 dun. Watch the opening. Wait, do I do I press on this then? Do I press on Nightmare and Greg Green like? <laughs> the vibing. Okay, all right, I'll do it. I'll do it for you, Waza, because you uh, you're so nice to me always. You know, you ask so nicely. <laughs> Ew! Why is it so crunchy, dude? I feel like I need to, I feel like I'm watching a YouTube video on auto for 460 or whatever, 420. Oh, it seems this is the entrance. <laughs> I always love the backgrounds. Green Lake campsite. We are now at the uh, Green Lake. Is he oh my God. What the hell? Um, Seeing, not gonna lie, seeing reverse 1999 backgrounds kind of makes me want to get into concept art for, like, environments, right? Like, environmental art. Michael, a self-explanatory fool, he leads the life of a clown in front of his popular peers like a companion animal to them. Aww, he's gonna die first. He has turned himself into one of those No, he is the one that's, like, monkeys, gonna live until the end, with and then... Filled with junk food, alcohol, and psychedelic potions. All right. He's the one that lives, like, way too long because they're lucky, and then... And then he dies a very heroic death, and then it, suddenly you feel for him. Right? Oh, Green Lake campsite. Oh, that's some douche. Find a clean and vast lake Thank you for the hydrate. Hi, King. A swimsuit. Hello. And hi, Gallagher. I don't think I said hi to you. I'm a, I'm a hydrate. Uh, see my muscles? The young ladies will all crazily scream for the The young l oh, oh, oh. oh my god, he did not bark. He did not just bark. He did not just bark. The ladies are all gay, bro. You have no chance. Oh my god. <laughs> Dice of cringe, yeah. Freddy, an athlete. Captain of the school's rugby team, an ostentatious, self-centered, and annoying narcissist. Yeah, I'm. Yeah, for free at <laughs> the Borgs, I guess. He is in the prime. If you're into that, I guess. A period which will be recalled repeatedly and eagerly decades later. Uh, like a drunk man obsessively licking the salt off the snack. Wait, so he lives though, because the narrator just spoiled it for us, right? Which will be recalled repeatedly and eagerly decades later. So are you telling me he lives? That is so not right. Damn, Freddy. For one second in your life, oh, could you God. please stop thinking about taking your pants off? That's the nerd. Why was pants 
Wait, what? Why was pants? They they try they, they they just censored. I heard the censor sound. They just they just censored pants. Or did he say penis or something? Which doesn't make sense, but huh? What? I have so many questions. There's weird censoring, apparently, right? Oh, but da yeah, okay, I get it that they do it for saying damn, but pants? Jason, what? The young scholar. He is the teacher's favorite student. Straight A's, clever, reliable, and logical. That's you, chat. Um, I bet 10 US dollars Freddy dies first. He gave more respect to girls than most Now I have to play it on stream. Oh god. His interest is reading those encyclopedias or looking into some strange science stuff. Wow. He pays more respect to girls than most of the idiotic men do. Damn. You can wipe your face with this, Michael. Aww. We will get to the camp soon. And the virgin. <laughs> the virgin! A <laughs> harmless amount of gentleness and beauty what? Charm that you don't get to see much of in this crazy time. Th that's just her title? She has a fucking title? She just she did they just call her that? Huh? She was born and raised in a faithful Christian family, along with other sisters. She attends the reading session held in her community every weekend. Oh my lord. Ugh. Oh my oh, lord! Enough shouting. <laughs> Hello? Can we can we keep her alive for a while? Oh. Jesus. I'm still over, so don't mess with me and everybody will stay happy. Understand? Right. Blondie. Reckless and dumb. A typical blondie. Always indulging herself in alcohol, beautiful clothes, and other vain pleasures. She was luckily born into a wealthy family and raised by doting parents. People call her sweetheart or honey. Nothing else. Yeah, wrong command, Zara. Wrong command. Hannah was done dirty. It's true. She's so cute. She's so cute. It's stereotype for horror. I, I guess. I guess. Yeah. Now we are going to bonfire camping area, right? Where's our guide? That's Zara. Oh my god. Jason feels like the murderer. Like Jason War Warhees. I don't know how to say that. Um, I don't know. Is one of them gonna Just be the to be evil clear, person? Uncle I don't know. Eli lent us the place, but he did also mention it's a bit neglected, so you know what to expect. When we get there, clean up the house and leave the best bedroom to me. You can choose from the rest. Wow. Okay. Michael will be glad to help you, sweetie. Ew! <laughs> you suck, bro. Take Anne with you. A girl would know to attend to details. Oh my God. One day she will pay for her doings. One day. Wait, are they dating though? Like then it's okay, I guess. But I don't think they are, right? Or are they? They didn't say that, did they? Oh, it's so beautiful. These young people cross the woods and head towards the campsite. When they get there, they make fire, sit down in a circle, and tell stories, just like how other people would have enjoyed a camping. I've never been they camping, and I, I don't dead. want to. I, I, Their heads I'm were good. hung at the treetop. It wasn't until a week later were they found by other campers. Murderer? No, there was no murderer. At least nobody has ever seen one. Some said Why is it he was so... done by a person who has long lost his humanity, that he was possessed by some demonic spirits, and therefore immortal. <laughs> no, okay. Michael, you fool! All Stop right. telling such a dumb story. Come maintain the bonfire, idiot. Idiot. But I haven't finished the story. No, uh, I mean, all right, on my way. Oh my god, this is gonna be great, isn't it? <laughs> hey, do you guys smell anything? Something quite gross, like a uh, putrid? A corpse. His smile freezes as another wave of car sickness washes over him. Never mind. Oh, 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 
Oh, oh gosh, I just saw it. Viscera? <laughs> what is happening? Jeez, F you. Don't throw up on me, Michael, you damn jerk. Oh. <laughs> Step back. What is going on? Also, why? I'm sorry, but why does he remind me of Welt? Is that just me? This is a badger. Do I have brain Judging from or the degree of putrefaction, it has died at least a week ago. Lonnie and Freddy have fun times in a car and they get murdered both at once, I bet. Did it's like in, you know the, um, uh, in, uh, in, uh, what, oh god, what's the game called? Until Dawn. You know, Until Dawn, when the, when, uh, isn't he also, isn't he called Michael? And what's her name? Jessica? Isn't she called Jessica or something? And don't they, they go to this shed, right? And then she gets fucking kidnapped or whatever by the Wendigo thing. And it's kind of dis disturbing. And they also wanted to bang. And then they, they ended up not banging because, you know, then they kind of, maybe they die. It depends on how good you play the game, I guess. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Lonnie, did your uncle mention any beasts living in the woods? Jason is pre world. Well. Oh Blunt. my god. Oh my goodness. They sneaked away again. In this very moment. That guy's oh, not even close to well, But kind of though. I think so. But kind of though. She left with Freddy when Michael started puking. Oh god. Also, hi Asta. It is, am I high or does she look like Jessica? Like, huh? The two young people who are away from the others are now in each other's arms! Huh? What the fuck? Is this- hello? Oh. <laughs> You're naughty. How did you know? Pre-played, pre pre-played, pre-played. <laughs> yeah, I can push this further. So they are dating. See. I will- Oh shit! Uh, Pre-played! Pre-played! Wait, who was it? Wait, 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 wait. Oh my god. What the fuck is happening? Oh shit, wait. <laughs> that is so predictable, dude. Help! Help! So predictable. Oh my fucking god, you just got murdered. Uh, well... Jamming. Acknowledgement. <laughs> what? <laughs> Ohio Mystery Investigation Bureau. What? Zeno Armaments Engineering and Technology Academy. Wait, was that the. Huh? Is this the credits? Tip of the Green Hat. Irish Penny Whistle Band. Friends from Green Lake. Oh god, it's glitching. <laughs> the freaking jam. I played it, got called it. Yeah, to be continued. All right. All right. Uh, okay. I don't know. Do you guys do you guys want me to do this? You think this could be cool? I think it could be cool. The start of a tragedy or maybe the beginning of an adventure. Wait, so is this after? There's moist critical here, I see that. <laughs> let's go, let's do it. Let's do it. Acknowledgement might be a weird transition of credits. <gasps> you're right, you're right. No, I don't think I can. Timekeeper, now that we have given the report, I mean, I think I can finish uh, chapter four before the event ends, but not like not today, you know. And Madam Z said we won't have any other assignments for a while. It may be a little abrupt to ask, but I was wondering if you would like to take a heritage train ride with me. The heritage train ride? Oh, she's blushing. Hold up. 
On the other side of the corridor, full of foundation stuff. Someone is also hitting one that end after another. Please, trust me. This what journey will mean? be the best ever. Let's start off immediately and come back furtively so nobody will know. No, thank you. I'm not interested. I have questions, but I'm not going to ask them because, uh, yeah, chapter four, I guess. Okay, <laughs> fine. Oh, wait, Angie, do you want to travel? Let's start off immediately and come back furtively so nobody will know. I'm flattered you asked, but I'm leaving for assignment soon, so I'm not going to make it. Really? Oh, that's a sad coincidence. I heard that you've worked so hard and have saved up so many unused leaves. You also have two days of outing permission. How do you know you stalker? What the hell? Leave her alone. The young man turns around, suddenly raises his arm and comes his way. Oh, hey guys. Oh, it's him. All right. Hashida <laughs> Soryo. Why? No. Us? Yes, you guys. Our great Miss Timekeeper and her excellent assistant, Sonetto. Am I right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> I've never heard of these names. Uh, yeah. Accepting the title great without hesitation, you are really the Verdon we've heard about. Heard about? We all know the trouble you stirred up. I was several grades above you. Though the instructors prohibited any discussions of that incident, they couldn't stop people from being curious. But soon no one asks about that anymore, because it is the wrong thing to do. And there was no vacancy in the guardhouse. Anyways, I remember you. Okay. Don't worry, Timekeeper. Although his manner is debatable, he's not a bad person. He was the one who received the Outstanding Contribution Award in the latest annual appraisal. Allow me to introduce... But no, wait! Don't use that name. Here with Timekeeper, just call me Horopedia, which I prefer. All right. All right. Uh, in chapter one, they mentioned before a story, Verdon saved over 60 arcanists. It was basically a sad story. Just saving another one. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Okay, Mr. Ha. He becomes Arbidia? Chad. I've never heard of this nickname of yours. <laughs> it's a long story. I can share with you at another time. Now, let's get down to business. Have okay. you guys heard of the myth of the Green Lake campsite? Um. What? What are these? So it was you who sent me the letter, I guess? <laughs> yeah, it was me. Given that you didn't know me, I sent it anonymously. I don't know what letter, but sure. I don't see how these are correlated. Well, of course they are. An anonymous envelope better triggers curiosity. And you are the most inquisitive person I know. Oh yeah, we got more emotes. Yeah, 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 yeah. We got uh, we got uh, five more animated emotes, and I added the the what emote back <laughs> because Frost asked for it. Frost was very very devastated. We didn't have it anymore, so I added. Didn't it Didn't you back. worry this time might throw it away? Honestly, I did. So I wrote to another 13 people. Now I have six masks. But yeah, now you get you get 20 emotes. 20 emotes for being a sub. Uh, don't be upset. Yours is the most intact one, so I selected it. Thank you for your approval. A mystery solved. No wonder I found the handwriting on the envelope familiar. I did some research on Green Lake Campsite after piecing together the map. <laughs> It was the map of one of the training bases of Xeno. They used to train their youth force there in the early 60s and deserted that base in the early 70s. It had been underused even before it was abandoned. It was more of a Boy Scout camping site than a military training base. Okay. Exactly, Miss Sonetto. <laughs> exactly, Miss Sonetto. This is the outdated Actually, this is not your fault. You haven't been in the headquarters for a long time, so you must have missed out on some first hand information. Now, about the Green Lake campsite, we have some updates. Oh god, he has the crazy eyes. Hi, Yumi! Hello, how's it going? Mm, see a name shuffle around. If we can, oh, I've seen it. See a name shuffle around. We have horophobia. Oh, interesting. Oh, what is this? An enigmatic look appears on horror. Hor it's not even horopedia, it's horopedia. Horopedia's face, his voice drops. That was a night in 1971. A night with pouring rain. 
heavily and hastily, sheets of rain formed a barrier, isolating the woods from the outside world. In that rain, the communication center of Zeno lost contact with the Green Lake campsite. Was it normal rain? It was. Drops of water with dust falling from above. It didn't cause any illusions or unusual symptoms, but took away all the youth force stationed at the campsite. In the cabin they lived, people found clothes, blankets, even books left open on the table. What does not move or breathe stayed there as usual, but their owners, those living youngsters, disappeared from the woods like drops of dew under the sun. So poetic. <gasps> Since then, nobody has ever seen those youth force again. Zeno has not, nor Laplace, nor us. Green Lake Campsite has then become a ghastly and deserted land. Miss mm, Sinetto, please put down your hands. They are hindering your ears from receiving information. You might then miss the climax. Is she scared? Thank you for the kind reminder. It was an unforgettable night. Three months later, all the missing members of the youth force came back to Zeno. They carried the smell of fungi and moist air, stepping Ew. into their dorm without making any noise. They claimed that they just came back from a tough mission in the rainforest. No one knew what the mission was. No one knew which rainforest they referred to. The personality of all those kids have changed. The outgoing Bruno became speechless. The gentle Anna Quini starts picking quarrels with others. They were not who they were, but no one could pin down the difference. Day after day, the smell of fungi and moist soil never disappeared. It lingered for one week, two weeks, three weeks. Why does he say it like that? One Stop night, it. Grade one student Drius suddenly woke up from his dream. A muddy tentacle stretching out beneath his bed, Ew. closed around his ankle and pulled him onto the floor. There, a face awaited him. A hideous face of a human-like creature with a bloody mouth. <gasps> Sonetto? <laughs> Sonetto, easy. You were going to break your wand. I know. I... I was just a bit caught off guard. It has never come to my mind that such a bizarre event would take place within an official institution. <laughs> she had tears in her eyes. Oh my god. Funny story, Mr. Horopedia. As an urban myth, however, the ending is way too clear and powerful. The element of drama ruins its authenticity. I know, right? Dude, I hate that. You know, I, I don't like it when in horror... And this happens way too often because at some point you want like a concrete like a thing you want like a specific thing you want to uh, figure out what the thing is that is like b making the problems right which makes sense but to me the biggest effect horror can have is being undefined right and it being like oh this weird thing is happening and we don't really know why and it's you know like the whole the whole thing with junji ito which usually that's like very cryptic and even though it is pretty graphic and kind of like it is specific like specific things happen it's like why is this happening and you never really get the context you never get the reason why. It's, it just happens because everything's horrible, right? And I think that's why that is so powerful. And a lot of stories kind of go and at some point this cryptic thing becomes, oh, it's this thing, it's that thing. And, and you see the monster suddenly. And that's yeah, boring right. and I don't like that because then suddenly it's not scary anymore because you know exactly what you're dealing with. And we don't know why. Why is this happening? That just sounds like <laughs> blind prog to me, Lamar. The real horror, yes. Ha yeah, sorry, what's the question? What is the question? Um, but Stranger Things did this, and I will never forgive them because Stranger Things was so amazing, and it was always this, like, first season, it was this thing, you know kind of what you're dealing with, but not really. And it's very cryptic, and it's, it's so nice, and... Uh, and there's this whole like unknown of the upside down and it was really really cool and you know there's a creature 
like you know there's the creature called the demogorgon all right and you don't really know how it works but you know it works with certain rules and all of that and you know the upside down work works with certain rules but it was still shrouded in so much mystery that it was really interesting and then all the later seasons all the seasons after season one well i guess season two was okay uh, still but everything after that was just like it was way too oh we want action we want it to be specific we want the specific villain to be there we want the specific thing to be very uh clear to the audience that this thing is the problem and i hated that i really hated that what do i do when i'm ep in the morning and need an extra kick of energy uh, then you take <laughs> Is this a setup for me to do an ad? Because you definitely should uh, get some rogue energy and energize yourself with rogue. And you can use my 20% code axolotl to get 20% off all the products and your like your order. order. Uh, so go ahead and check out rogue energy. And they even have a little starter pack where you can test all the flavors and uh yeah and you don't even have to pay and you can just check out just some of their flavors and test them for yourself if you like them let's go <laughs> you're good at making stories next time you can be more meticulous huh huh so you know thank you mr Trevor. good setup good setup good setup what what flavor are you drinking then zara huh? military talents which one are you getting present uh, uh, uh. <gasps> there she is! The of youth force were relatively younger, with less combat experience and capability compared to those graduates. Still, they have received years of training as reserve soldiers. As we all know, Xena would arm their youth force and the trainers with drill weapons for outings. Okay. It was nearly impossible to wipe out a youth force in the territory of Xeno without being noticed by the Academy. I see. So it's not true. Just a made-up story. Miss Toothberry, did you come back from the trip? I rerouted my journey to a new destination. My companion suggested us to meet at the Foundation first, so I came back earlier. Anything wrong with the original destination? It's fine and safe. But now I have a better place to go. It's a place of myths and danger. There once lived many adolescents. With any luck, I will embrace a harvest of baby teeth. I- Huh? Uh, okay, okay, un unpack that. Hold up. It's a place of myths and danger. There once lived many adolescents. I like how she said that, like, the adolescents were a problem. Which is true. The adolescents were probably a problem. And they were probably dangerous, and it was all horrible, so that's funny. Second of all, what do you mean? Harvest, uh, uh, I will embrace a harvest of baby teeth. I, I'm scared. No the place you're heading is, it's Green Lake Campsite. But wasn't it a story? A story made up by Mr. Horopedia? So she literally goes around and is like, give me your teeth. I need your teeth. <laughs> Second, next time you get sponsored by Rook, make the code Exolotl. Oh my god. As an ex drink, yeah. yeah. Maybe I can change the code. Maybe <laughs> maybe I can ask them to change the code. You need a part of it, such as the bloody hands underneath the bed and the midnight screaming. Oh god. Good idea, good idea. Sour candy right now? Uh, yeah, I... <laughs> I want to pull in the gears in her face, make them go sploing. Yeah, it's so weird. Like this thing that she has is so weird, and there's spikes on it, right? There's spikes on it. Except for those, the rest is exactly the same. And I don't know what the reason them. is. But as you just said, in their own training base, it's almost impossible for the youth force to be. It proves that Green Lake Campsite is out of this world, a place worth visiting. You're three minutes and 15 seconds late, Miss Tooth Fairy. Actually. No worries. <laughs> I didn't waste my time waiting. We need more people to join us. Angie and Adolf have turned me down, but Verdin and Sonetto haven't walked away yet. I am trying to win them over. I think I'm almost there. 
Now, they are really attracted by the green lake, so we are starting off soon. Dude has a freaking gun. Attracted? Pardon me, Ju Mr. Horopedia. We did not plan to go there, and we certainly do not feel any strong attraction to that place. Oh, really? But Verdon seems to be very attracted. To women, or yeah. am I mistaken about the look on her face? Timekeeper. Several pairs of eyes look I over. I am kind of attracted indeed. See that? I am right. I'm glad to see you in an adventurous spirit, Miss Burton. <sighs> Wait, what's poor in the water, huh? Great! Where? Take your suitcase, pack your clothes, don't forget to bring two novels to kill time. Now, let's take the hands of our two new partners. Journey on! Oh, God. Please, wait a minute! Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. We're all gonna die. <laughs> We're all gonna die. Calm down, it was a misinput. Oh, a misinput! Oh, okay, okay. Wait, you wanted to do the waiting riot. Okay. You didn't want to do the wait. This is. <laughs> Alright, okay, I see. Mess in for Okay, okay, chill. We can just make the whole stream just being in this menu. Somehow the jamming cat, the plink vibe just fits so well. <laughs> I love it. Oh my god! <laughs> Bopping. Amazing. <laughs> I love it. Um, they were taken away, leaving a bump in the smooth roads. Whatever that means. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. It's so crunchy. <laughs> the screen is so crunchy for no reason. Baby teeth. Oh no. Oh no. Thank you for the letter, Emily. Now, we are bringing our driver friend the latest weather forecast. Ohio is having a sunny week. <gasps> oh, the not Ohio! <laughs> oh, and no. zero chance of rain. Was well, already said it, it's in Ohio. I forgot to switch off the radio. We're going to Ohio. Sit tight and put on your safe belt. Hold the hands of people sitting next to you. The real if horror. Necessary, close your mouth and clench your teeth. You can do as I said, or not. I was mainly talking to them. Yes, madam. What the hell? Yes, Miss Tooth Fairy. Are those little winged elves still nagging you? I remember you were troubled by them as early as I was in school. They are still there. They have never left there. The good thing is that they can't distinguish lies. They spend every second of their life overhearing me and totally believe what I say. As long as they hear me say, cover your mouth and clench your teeth, they will never attack you. We all owe Mr. What Campbell the a big fuck? thank you for this. All of his teeth were stolen when he was with Miss Tooth Fairy. That's when humans finally realized how vindictive and vengeful those little things are. So does she have it so they don't steal her teeth? Oh my god, that's so... That is such a, like, nightmare. That's literally, like, a nightmare thing, right? When you, when you, when you dream, you lose your teeth. That's apparently a super popular nightmare of people to have. They stepped across the world for the cure. Eventually, they found a solution. Mr. Campbell? Who is this person, and what happened to him? He is my brother. I am also a Campbell, Miss Campbell, while he is a mister. We shared a roof when we were little. I was cursed for eating a tooth fairy. It and its fellow swore to steal all my teeth. Ah, uh, yes, okay, I see. Oh, God. At first, why did she eat did it? it? I ate nine fairies and lost eleven baby teeth. What the fuck? My parents soon found out. They ordered a special tooth brace for me in case I lose all my baby teeth and become a horrific old lady. In their second attack, those tooth fairies failed to steal the teeth from Miss Campbell, so they rushed to Mr. Campbell. His teeth disappeared in a flash. And you never had one since then. D what the so fuck? It was the curse of the tooth fairy. Just like in books, the flying human-like critters are bigoted. 
Once gained, they will keep the love and hatred at heart forever. I'm so sorry, Miss Tooth Fairy. I shouldn't have asked. Don't worry, sweetie. My brother now has his own teeth. He lives a stable life. <laughs> the past is in the past. And I don't really think he was cursed. I've never heard the Tooth Fairy swore at him. Neither have I found any mark on him that can be detected by Arcano. Instead of being cursed, what he suffered is more likely to be a congenitally missing tooth, a term defined in human medical science. I know that case. I just never thought Mr. Campbell lost his because of this. None of my classmates or instructors ever doubted the authenticity of such a curse when they gossip of such things. SPDM is a community of a bunch of young arcanists and several instructors. BDSM, what? For those kids, a curse is more common than a disease diagnosed by human medical science. As a result, they neglected what they can't comprehend and only learned the story from a one-sided perspective. Soon enough, rumors started to spread. But that was a curse. A trouble that you can't easily shake off once you were put under. People could hardly forget that. If Tooth Fairies could curse his sister, they could also curse him. Everything came naturally. That was it. Mm -hmm. Kids were ignorant for lack of knowledge. Yet adults were ignorant for their cognitive inertia. In a story where truth and falsity are mingled together, it is hard to tell which is which. Only dream I have had about teeth is that I had several rows. Oh god. When you moved your tongue, you could feel them scraping against the top of my mouth. Ew. Ew. Yeah, that's horrible. Yeah, I hate, I hate when you have like dreams about your own body and it's like body horror. <laughs> That is so awful. I I wouldn't. I don't think I'll ever forget one dream I had, uh, where I had like that's it's just, it's kind of it's kind of it's it's very uh, it's kind of disgusting. Um, I mean, just as disgusting as that, right? But like, I had a um, a black thread going through my hand. Like, I don't know why, it was just like, and, and it, it really hurt, like, and, and I had to pull it out because, you know, and it, it left like little, uh, because it was rope, right? It left little um, pieces, like pieces of the rope, of the fiber, in my hand, in the whole of my hand, it was horrifying. After <laughs> all, life is not a show. It's so, uh, and so, stuff like that, I hate that. Ahead. Oh, I hate that. And I'll never, i never forget that, right? Because, yeah, like, no thank you. <laughs> Go away. Leave you. Oh god. Careful. Don't drive over him. Oh my god. Oh my god. <coughs> Timekeeper? Miss Toothberry? <coughs> Are you alright? We're good. Don't worry. Cover your mouth and nose. Get out of the car. Is everyone okay? Did somebody get hurt? Timekeeper, you... Go away! Go! Go away! Get out of my woods! <laughs> <laughs> I heard Did you it. just shove her? I heard it. I've... I've heard the gods will. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God, indeed. <laughs> oh, God. I will guide your children. I will guide them. Guide them away from the demons. Uh, uh, from the land of demons. Dilated pupils, disordered speech, and a body temperature of three degrees higher than the normal level. How do you know? Presumably, oh my God, he has she's taken cracked. some stimulants or substandard potions. His sanity has been taken away. We need to knock him out. Oh my god, the music. Okay, what do we do? Oh my god, the music. Mm. Anyone offer your seat to the senior? And oh my god, the music. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. 
idea. Take it easy. Break it, break it. <laughs> Jamming. Sheesh. It's all right. I believe in you. Handle it gently. Handle Take it gently. It easy. A little bit hot here. Oh, he didn't murder himself, Sedge. My sword shot. That's the idea. Did anybody get hurt? So long lives this. And this gives power to thee. Break it, break it. Let's go. Than the foundation's kids. I'm scared. She scares me. <laughs> he fainted out. Problem solved. But my car broke down. We have to walk there. No problem, Miss Two Fairy. I took the map with me before we got out. But there is smoke coming out of your car. Is it all right? It'll be fine. Don't worry, Virgin. My brother bought an insurance. The brokers will soon contact him. Eternity. <laughs> she's cool. I like her. And she's a good unit. Let's go. Old notebook. A notebook pieced together with tattered pages. It tells of a gruesome green lake mystery. A notebook, tattered and old. It once recorded certain stories. It belonged to that old man who just lost his mind. You must know something, otherwise he wouldn't have tried to stop us. Maybe we can restore this notebook. That way, we'll be able to learn some stories about Green Lake. Pick up. Let's go. The cryptic note dropped by that demented old man. They seem to contain a story pertaining to Green Lake. Ah, there's some information in the notebook, but most of it has been torn out. There are traces of dirt near the missing information. Maybe we'll find them when, while we're exploring the camp, okay? The notebook has also also has a few empty tabs. Looks like there isn't just one story. Burly build. A slip left behind from some notes. A meat cleaver in hand, Jack walked from one house to the next. You ought to know he'd never let any naughty little trespassers off that easily. All right. All right. The cold metal tastes like toothless gums. Whatever the hell that means. Oh my lord. TF? What's T? Who's T? Oh, Two Fairy. Two Fairy over Karen. Mm. Mm. I'll have to disagree personally. <laughs> this. This must be the camp. <sighs> I sniff conspiracy in the air. What will happen here? Hmm. Murder? <gasps> Sacrifice? Spy attack? Or evocation? Well, I think Baby Blue is the best. Let Just my humble this. opinion. <gasps> what do we have here? These things have been left here catching dust. And I see no footprints or any signs of activity. Seems like it has been deserted for a long time. Iron buckets, felling axes, picnic mats. Considering we are in a campsite, it is only normal to expect these tools to be here. Hmm. What is this? Tooth Fairy can fix me. Well, that's fine with me, Ark. That's fine. Baby Blue's my favorite character. Let's go. I think she's the prettiest. I mean, there's like this voyage. It's she's called Voyager, right? Characters like that, I just love. They're like so pretty. I also think Eternity is pretty, but she's not like impressive pretty. I think Baby Blue looks very different from other units, kind of. If that makes sense. And she's like cute and pretty in an impressive way. I don't know. I, I don't know. I think it's because her hair and her dress, it's also like big, so it looks more 
It looks more impressive. But then, like, I think Voyager is one of the prettiest units as well. Uh, um, they lose perpetually stoned? Hey, 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 nothing wrong with that. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Does she, does she get a story? Is she just... Or is she just like a character that's, that just exists? Because if she has a story somewhere, I really want to know. But it feels like she's just like a gimmick character, kind of. So far, at least. The Fool is my favorite character. Yeah, I have I have The Fool. But I, I, I don't know. Voyager's Cosmos Horror that took a name of Voyager to s be sent to space and Crony looks to come to us um well maybe yes but not yet yeah yeah i was thinking maybe at some point but some characters who saved before story mm, yeah it's it's kind of interesting because she has the whole wonderland theme and i kind of want to know more about that how that would work in the universe but again i don't know if they would give her a story but anything probably have you found anything Sonato? Something is buried in the ground. Right here. She breaks a twig from the bush without hesitation. She pushes the mud clods aside with the twig. A box made of iron or aluminum. It looks like like a candy box. Candy! Yeah. Rust. It has been buried here for four to five years. A kid's candy box? No. Adults can love candies too. It's true. But looking at it from a different angle. Is its owner still alive? What happened to the person here? Why was this box buried with a battered magazine? From the traces of activity here, it's probably been left by its indiscreet owner. Wait. This is the Green Lake campsite. We just met a madman who called himself an oracle. He drove people away from the land of demons. Open it. If this is from a brutal crime, there might be some evidence inside. We are all ears, Miss Verdon. The metal box opens up. There's nothing in it except for the metal that made up the that made up of the box. This is not a candy box. It is a pill box. Correction. It is an empty pill box. Your button is too fairy. What did you find when you explored the campsite? Roughly the same as here. Near the woods, there's a place for firewood cutting. More traces left by critters can be found near the woods than here. I also found the teeth and claw marks of giant critter, as well as some excretion. That is to say, one gigantic critter inhabits here? If not more? Yes, that's why I came back here. Watch out for the critters. We may have stepped in their territory. The bushes rustle, just like the crucibles always give up a smoke when a witch casts the spell. What? <gasps> Ew! Disgusting. So what happened? Did you not take your rogue energy? <laughs> this is also the right moment for a spooky figure to rise from the bush. What do you mean a spooky figure, dude? That's the that's a thing of nightmares. Holy shit! That's not a critter. That's a fucked up looking dog, dude. That's not a critter. Jesus Christ. Oh, God. Yeah, I understand. I'll tell them to be careful, yes. Thank you for your advice. Bye. Bye. Angie, come in. This is the file that the timekeeper submitted. It's about the storm. Please hand it to the research department. Affirmative. I will bring it to them. Next month, your squad will be dispatched to North America to join Xeno for a joint mission. The tactical unit under the timekeeper will be replaced by the third squad. Please complete the handover procedure before you leave. She said, I'm not gonna lie, she sounds like she's voiced by AI. Sometimes I'm like, what the hell is with, what the hell is with the- By the way, your application for the, the outing permission has been permitted. The document will be posted to your door mailbox by 7 p.m. tomorrow. I'm very grateful for your help, Madam Z. You're welcome. Get some good rest. Don't forget to remind your team members that actions outside areas mentioned in the application will now be allowed. 
They need to return back to the headquarters by the specified time and check in once they're back. I will, Madam Z. I will look after them. Off you go. Oh, hey, Angie. I heard that Toothberry has returned to the Foundation. Please tell her to come by my office when she's available. Miss Toothberry? Um, I suppose she has gone by now. On my way here, I saw Joshua and Vertim were with her. They seem to be planning to travel. Joshua? To travel? No. No. I haven't received his outing application. W which means... <sighs> he did have some past records of violation, such as being late, absent from duty, and taking actions without permission. His past records means that his outing application will not be permitted. Me before rogue energy drink. <laughs> oh my god. It's Sars creepy great 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 grand uncle. True. Uh, don't you dare diss me. I'm not dissing her. I'm just saying she sounds like a robot. Very like the the speech is very uh, non emotional. Very low voice, low tone, like monotone. Um, and like cut off kind of you know and yeah i mean she is she is she is voiced by a non-native speaker i think that I, I i'm like i'm pretty sure that's the case but yeah mm, when i just say wait uh, i hope she's playable just like me but i hope forget me not will be playable yeah maybe this NPC does sound like an AI voice character most of the time. Yeah, I was always thinking that, right? It's because like, it's it's not it's not the accent even because that is like whatever. But it's mostly the um, just the way it kind of the way it, the sentences are read or like said, I guess, and the way it's just so monotone, right? He must be well aware of it. That's why he wasn't even bothered to apply for one. My, no wonder he always said, let's start off immediately and come back furtively so nobody will know. Don't be nervous. Our priority now is to get them back and minimize the possible consequences. Angie, do you know where they're going? He, he, he mentioned, I'm, I'm trying to recall. Um, it's, uh, Green Lake. They were heading to Green Lake campsite. Green Lake? You mean the Green Lake campsite established by Zeno? Yes, Madam Z. It's even worse now. I'm sorry, Angie. Please inform the 7th and 5th squad to stand by. We'll head out at any time. Yes, I'll fetch them now. Okay. Found Saka's creepy great 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 grand uncle in the world of horror? Share. Share. <laughs> Hello? Is it the liaison department of Xeno Armaments Academy? I am Z. Please put me through Lieutenant Banya. The flow of speaking, yeah, like that, right? But there's like no way to use the AI for it. It's just, I think it's just the voice actor sounding very unique, which is not a bad thing. I think it fits the character very well. It's just interesting how it sounds like that because it's so, so unique, yeah. What I can tell the individual who voices C is under a pseudonym and is Japanese. Oh. Yeah, I don't think they would use AI for this. That would be weird. They have like really high quality voice actors and and the voice acting is really good, so it would have really surprised me. <laughs> Jesus! What was that? Did someone scream? My god, Jason. We have to check it out. I know they like to fool around, but we are here now. Annie lowers her voice and looks into the depths of the shadow. She remembers a terrible story about the woods. Michael, stay here and take a rest. Shh. Don't make any noise. Uh, uh, Alright. They will all be fine, huh? Uh, I don't know Hope about so. that. Is he goth? Lonnie? Lonnie? Ego, 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 the irresistible gaze. 
Should I look that up? Dun, 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 dun. Oh, it's a fat axolotl. <laughs> that is terrifying. What the hell? What is that game? Ew, that's a game, right? Ew. Ew, 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 okay. <laughs> terrifying, terrifying. It's an old god who wants to take everyone to the underwater kingdom? No, thank you. Don't I'm play good. Hide and seek. I'm good. This is not funny. <laughs> Wait. Look over there. Under pseudonym to hide. It's not an actual human, I see. No, I, I don't think that's I don't think that's the case because there is so far there has been no trace of any AI work and we know that there's some like renowned voice actors in this, so it would really surprise me if one of the basically main voice characters that appears in the main story was just AI. That, I don't know. The waist, a waist hide bush shakes suspiciously. It's lush enough for an adult to hide behind. Bonnie? N no. Uh, Freddy? Are you there? Not funny at all. Not cool. You do always like to spook people like this. I will not dead. believe it. <sighs> Scary. Hand, stay back. Oh boy. <laughs> Run away! The sharp blade cuts through the bushes and their noses instantly catch the grassy smell. They stumble backward and fall to the ground. What the hell was that? Run the fuck away! Why are you stumbling? The, the, the stories are all true. All true. How is that possible? It is not in compliance with the laws of nature. What do you mean, dude? It's a murderer! What do you mean? The smell of blood hits them. Anna looks up and sees her friends who are lying behind the bushes and looking lifeless. No, 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 no this is not happening. Oh, Lord. No more crying, Anne. Stand up. No more kyring. Anne. I will look out for you. <laughs> no more kyring, Anne. Stop kyring. They, both of them are dead. My God. Jason, the blood is all over the place. Jason helps his trembling friend get back on her feet. His legs are shaking as well, but they have to keep on running as they dare not look back. Don't think too much. Don't look back. Run. Speed up. Jason, head down! Is he oh my god, Jesus Christ. No! Don't! Evans! Jason! Just run! Keep running! The blood of her dear friend fiercely spews out of his body like a can of shaken soda was finally open. Nice. The body without a head falls backwards. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Jesus Christ. The air is fishy. Anna keeps retreating one step after another. All right. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, hi, we're back to you, okay. Damn it, it's catching up. It's moving too fast. I've never seen a critter this big. Not only the size, its strength and speed are also much enhanced from what we learned in the arcane features class. It took Miss Toothberry's velvet pocket. We have to bring it down before it's too late. Horopedia, do you have some cobweb bullets to trap it? Only one left. Are you sure we have to fight it in the woods? We don't have an edge. The campsite was completely destroyed within 15 seconds. I don't suggest that we kill ourselves in this way. According to the map, there is the other campsite built in a wider region. We can fight it there. Turn left here. Keep going for 100 meters. And then cross the bush. Whoa! Shoot that bullet. It's going to get you. What a pity. I was thinking of catching something else. <laughs> She's right over there. Follow me. Let's speed up. Okay. 
Wait, whoa, 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 Oh, God. <laughs> Is he okay? Probably not. He's probably dying. Uh, Kaliadru, welcome in. Thank you very much for the photo. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I hope you're doing well. Um, it's called World of Horror for a reason. Yeah, I, I mean, yeah. What about Water Dragon and Fear and Hunger? Oh, I haven't seen that. Wait. I've seen videos about fear and hunger, but... Oh, that, yeah, that axolotl! Yeah, 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 yeah! I've s no, never mind, I've seen that. I've seen that. Yeah, it's called Salmon Snake. Yeah, fear and hunger is equally... Has an equal, uh, equally disturbing amount of, like... Or has an equally disturbing monster... Encyclopedia, whatever. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. Alright. Michael suffered an agonizing death. Let's go. He lied between bushes, moaning in pain as he lost more and more blood. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> as for Annie, she's she is like a tape player which only plays repeated screams. She monotonously repeats her denial of the situation and circles the camp rounds after rounds. Why? Just get the fuck and run anywhere! But the butcher's blade always lands on the ground one inch behind her heel, not even touching one bit of her body. Don't! Don't get closer! No, don't! Wait! You people are... Huh? The figure jumping out of the bushes. Ah, oh, it's Sonetto! Oh my god. Uh. My apologies. I didn't mean to intrude. Um. My god. What? What has happened here? <laughs> so I didn't mean to intrude. The murder. The murdering. Before coming out to the other side of the bush, none of them has ever expected such a horrific scene. A crazy murderer? Student campers? Oh, this is much more interesting than I expected! Uh... Protect the victims. Get ready to fight. Who are you? And the bushes? Why did you come out of the Please bushes? continue and leaves. Exactly. Worry not, miss. Please get behind. You're safe with us. They should be all be cut down by now. No, no, that's my friend. And they aren't... I understand. They deserve a decent funeral. After I take care of this demonic creature. Wait, what? Sonetto grasped her wand, keeping her friend behind. Wait, be is all us. set up? Sonetto, calm down. Oh no! Don't bury me! I don't want to die! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Wait, what, what? is happening? <coughs> <clears throat> this taste of cherry syrup is killing so me. So they're not actually dead. You? Wow. You still alive? Wow, wow, huh? wow. Of course. What kind of question is that? But you were vomiting blood, and that gentleman over there doesn't even have a head attached to his body. Uh, yeah, how did they do that? That's a prop. It looks like a real one. Nicely done. You add bloody taste substitute into the cherry syrup. Which makes it smell like the real blood. Ew. Be prudent about the dosage because it's slightly addictive. You've used too much. Uh, uh, what on earth is happening? Thank you, Sonetto. Thank you. Uh, hi, first plan to use sake as an alarm clock failed. Next time, increase volume further. Should I just scream at the start of the uh, of the stream? Next time. Um. <laughs> But hi, Frost. Sorry that didn't work. I'll this just scream, is a right? Yeah, boy. <laughs> a filming site. It's just a um. prank, bro. <laughs> just a prank. Just a prank. There's the camera. The prank. Someone legitimately died. Uh, you know that one YouTuber that did the prank where they kidnapped him and his friend, and the friend didn't know it was a prank because it was a prank, and then they killed the dude that made the prank, and then the person thought. The, his friend was really fucking dead and then they were like two years later they went like oh no we all knew uh, yeah it was just a prank uh, we all knew it was just a prank uh, yeah no that guy is definitely not traumatized <laughs> these young people are busy with their business <laughs> while we just interrupted wait, them whoa, 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 yep whoa, 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 whoa. 
well, yeah, well, that well, had did well. happen, then I'm not making that shit up, unfortunately. <laughs> scream Frost break up, yeah, I'll do that next time. My bad, my bad. I'll, I'll open every stream with that now. Every early stream, at least. That really happened? Yeah, that did happen. Uh, also, thank you, it's uh, Kedutz. Kedutz. Um, welcome in. <laughs> welcome in, welcome in. Thank you very much for the follow. I hope you're doing well. Yeah, but that did happen. That's a thing. I don't remember the name. Uh, and I don't... I think their channel got terminated. I think the dude's channel got terminated for it or something. Um, but yeah, they like they faked a kidnapping. And they ki they basically faked that two two dudes like the t like uh two b the two best friends got kidnapped and one of them is the owner of the channel that set the prank up and the other and his best friend the other guy that got kidnapped didn't know it was a prank and he legitimately thought a pair i guess uh the allegedly <laughs> That they were getting kidnapped and then they were like brought to a rooftop and then it's it sounds so crazy, right? Uh but yeah, and and they both got put on like chairs and uh I think the the dude that like the dude that knew had his eyes like they were both uh, obviously they were like, you know, uh taped up against the chairs and everything and then uh he had his eyes covered and then he got shot like he didn't get shot for real right but they they faked that he got shot and then the dude that wasn't in on it like his best friend apparently legitimately thought and like i saw the video i saw the video and it really seemed like th either it was like incredible acting or the dude was really like he was legitimately crying and screaming and it was very very like traumatizing obviously right so, and I just, I can't imagine that they faked it, but, like, it's a really fucked up situation, but then again, like, you, I don't know what is real and what is not anymore, but, you know, um, but, yeah, and, and then, like, uh, and then they, they, uh, you know, they went, aha, it's just a prank, bro, right, and then he got, the, the shot guy got up and he was like, haha, no, it's just a prank, haha, I pranked you, and it was so, yeah, and, like, there was a huge shitstorm about that. And then, like, two years later, I think the account got terminated. And then two years later, or something, or, like, some time later. I don't know where I'm getting it two years from. I just, I, I don't know. Sometime later, they went, like, they ha he had an interview with some other people on YouTube, I think. And he said that they were all, or the dude that got pranked had an interview and was there. And he said that he knew everything and everything was staged right so everything was staged and he actually knew that it was a prank but his reaction really didn't seem like it so i don't i don't know if i believe that i don't think i believe that right the sam pepper yes it's it was sam pepper yes 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 yes, yes you're right yeah and i think that i think that account is terminated right i think he isn't on youtube anymore what does it say? Mm. Grow oh my god. So there's a there's a whole section about growth and and controversy. And one literally just says fake hand ass pinch prank. The fuck is that? Uploaded a controversial video called fake hand ass pinch prank He in the video pepper would go up to women and ask for directions before pinching their buttocks nice I love people dude. I love people <laughs> And then there it is killing best friend prank in November 2015 dude that is so much l longer ago than I thought it was Holy hell also hi Hannah. Hello. And you I know I know yeah, but you can read up on it yourself, but yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Did they get... Yeah, here. A subsequent online petition to have Pepper removed from YouTube gained over 100,000 signatures. Did he get terminated, though? 
In the response to the ongoing criticism, Pepper started a GoFundMe campaign stating that he would delete his YouTube channel if 1.5 million was pledged to him? What? The campaign was removed shortly afterwards along with the accompanying video that was posted on his YouTube video. Apology and rebranding afterwards. And then he did an apology video. That is so much worse than I thought it was. 1.5 million on a GoFundMe and then he was like, then I'll delete my channel. Dude, what in the ever fucking hell is happening? <laughs> He stopped uploading, uh, prank videos, began uploading vlogs, okay. In 2018, he stopped uploading on his main channel and rebranded to his Sam Pepper Life channel. Okay, and then he started streaming alongside- Oh, it all makes sense. He started streaming alongside Ice Poseidon. Uh-huh, alright. Alright, okay. Yeah, okay, now everything makes sense. And apparently there's another controversy now. Or not now, but in 2021. Oh, no, of course it has to do with, um, with tokens and, like, cryptocurrency. Dude, what is this, like, prank channel to, to cryptocurrency pipeline for, like, famous YouTubers or famous, famous Twitch streamers? Or, like, casino? What is happening? Dude, I, I'm anyway... <laughs> Are you two the actors anyway. Jennifer recruited? Cute, cute girls. We continue. I'm afraid I don't know this Jennifer. Cute anime girls. To. Let's go. <laughs> uh, my bad. She sometimes goes by the name Blonnie. It was just me who always calls her Jennifer. Oh. Damn it, you idiots! Get your ass up! There's no way we can use this take! <laughs> the bodies covered in blood get back on their feet. One after another, a girl with blonde hair and blood stains on her face rushes angrily over. Here she comes. Sorry, excuse me. She quickly wa wag her hands horizontally in front of her chest, turning around and trotting towards her friend like a fluttering little bird. Aww. You! Who are you? Oh my god, excuse me. Can we have the Chinese, uh, can we have the Chinese censorship for that one, please? Fatin. No, that's not what I'm asking! Huh? Are you asking me? I am Horopedia. Never mind, that dude does the to the dude needs to say in asylum. Yeah, I, sometimes I'm like, I, I keep getting surprised, I shouldn't be, but I keep getting surprised by what fame can do to people, right? And how crazy and insane people can get just to get clicks. It's, it's miserable. Uh, Horopedia's eyes light up, looking at each one of the people standing before him. And you are... Hmm... The big one, the athlete, the smaller one, the fool, and the slim one, the scholar, uh, the only girl who's standing here. It seems like the first girl who lay down. I'm talking about you, uh... <clears throat> right. A blondie. A blondie. Wow, wow. What the hell? <laughs> what is in your shrinked brain? <laughs> Oh my god. I'm asking who the hell you are, why you are here, and what do you break into my film site for? Crypto is also a prank. Close enough. It's true. It's it's so true. <laughs> good one. Good one. I think he switched to TikTok. Yeah, he gained another controversial there. Yeah, I mean, I'm not surprised. Film. I'm not surprised. Probably soon on kick or maybe on kick already. I don't freaking know. Yes, we were in the middle of shooting a movie. A horror movie. My mouse scroll is not working. Someone redeemed German. Why is she talking about this? No, no, no. I'm Jennifer good. Jennifer is our dir 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 director? director and playwright. Is that the word? Playwright? Playwriter? Horror movie? Here? He blinks. His face is suddenly lit by an unusual glow. Where is your gear? What's the story? I mean, what do you think the story is, bro? What's your business here? What? A aren't you confident enough? The gear is right here! It <gasps> you. What the hell? Good look at it, smartass. Uh, huh? The fuck was that? <laughs> Just, huh? I think this pattern shows that 
being an ass doesn't need creativity. Uh, it's true. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. I mean, I think I, I also think that the like a lot of very questionable people have gotten famous in the early days of the internet, like early days YouTube and like, you know, uh, Twitch and all of that. A lot of people got famous that I just don't understand why. And a lot of people watch those people for the wrong reasons because they just want to see them like lose their minds and they want to they want to be like the toxic community and be like, oh my god, like you're gambling away all this money. That's funny or that's fun. Uh, or oh you're you're being like um I think one of the one of the better examples is probably XQC. Um a lot of people I think enjoy XQC for how kind of this dysfunctional he is? Is that the right word? Which is weird to me because like it can be funny. It can be funny, but like the the thing with the I just remember the the scene where literally XQC's mates came in. He his his literal mates came in, right? To clean his room on stream and he he put up a, a text document thingy on his screen and he was like, Oh my god, I'm so embarrassed right now and then he didn't talk because he wanted he like he was waiting for them to leave and you could see them going around and picking up the trash, right? And then he 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 wrote on this text document, I'm so embarrassed right now, like for real and whatever, right? And I just thought it was so awkward and horrible. I would be so ashamed. And they like took away the trash and it was like lay, lying on the floor and everything and uh, like I'm sorry, but that just that I don't think like that that just stuck with me somehow it, 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 Like why why and they were clearly like they were looking pissed and it's like I would be pissed too Like okay, of course they're you know if I'm getting paid Whatever right, but still it's so Dystopian to see that some like 20 something dude is just sitting there doing react content or something and then you're like, and then you work for him, and he basically just trashes up his room. And then you have to clean up for him. Like, uh, huh? That's that's dystopian for, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'm just not, maybe, maybe I just don't have that content creator brain, you know? You know? <laughs> but yes. Also, hi, Shiera. Hello. Hello, hello. Hello, everyone. Hello. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Mm, is that a wait? Is that a reference? Um, is that a, that's a reference to that one anime scene, right? Isn't it? Isn't that the? I don't know the anime. It's not. Mm, I don't remember the name. Isn't that the like you look like the Japanese? Prime Minister or something? Does anyone know what I'm talking about? Probably not. <laughs> Recorder CCDTR57. Moving on, moving on. Oddly the specific. Version. A pretty one. It costs quite a lot and has many features. But welcome in. Don't worry about me. I'm just shell. Long standby time for operating independently. <gasps> and hand gesture triggered flashlights and lighting adjustments. Wow. Wow, you're a nerd. It's the first time to see a real one, other than those advertisements printed on magazines. <laughs> what a coincidence. How do you use the flash? Hey, wait. Uh, take your hands off me. Excuse me? We're lemon cat flies in as a teacher. Yes, that one. What's it called? I'm a semi. Of course I'm not. Yes, that one. How are you? Fine. Thank you. Yes, that one. Yes. Oh my god. Yes. I love that one. Wait, 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 wait. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Here, I'ma show it, 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 hold up. Wait. I have the weirdest recommendations in my YouTube right now. Um. Oh wait, you can't hear it, can you? Can you? No. Oh 
喋っとる<笑>娘がアメリカに行くのです。取り合ったら I just love the video, dude! It's so good! I love it! That's totally it, right? Hello, everyone! I'm so happy I recognize it. Oh my god! I literally don't know the context at all, right? I don't know the context at all. Oh no, we don't. No, 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 not the Sigma male grinding, please. Whatever the fuck that is, we don't want to see it. I'm good. Um, <laughs> I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I had like my my brain in the gutter so much that I remembered this. Alright, where's the browser? Get out of here. Alright. Um. Let me do this. Okay, we can get back to story now. I got it. I got it. I got it. Oh, stop it. Please. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> uh, she was not quick enough to avoid a horopedia who pinches the edge of her sleeve and drags her arms moving up and down. Okay, oh, so we're witnessing a wave, assault or right just now. Your glasses. Or an applause. Let go of me. Also, what did Zar say about the Chinese? Wait, hold up. I need to see. I I read over it. If they gave the blood Chinese sponsorship, those blood splatters and Blondie would be white. Exactly. That's what the, that that's what I was saying. Yeah, 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 yeah. Danganronpa style sensors. That's true. Yeah, they just make it pink. Yeah. Hmm. Yep. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm hmm. <laughs> uh. I wish I were a bird. It's cousin Russ. Yeah, 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 yeah. The Sata and Dagi scene. I don't even. What is that? Mm. Dude, such a dick. I love him. He's rude. <laughs> it's the applause. Now it's easier. Oh, God. Unbelievable. What the hell do you think you're doing? Piss off. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's still Five happening. minutes, 31 seconds. The sticky bullet should have been four times more powerful than this, but still within my estimation. Oh, the music. Hey, Blondie, clap your hands. God damn it, for freak's sake. Look what you brought here. Well, now they're in... Oh, God. The autofocus recorder sends generating a straw. Oh, my God! Why on me? I'm not the problem! Why did you have to flashbang me? The camera. Oh my god. Good. Now it's time. <laughs> that was unnecessary. That was so unnecessary. Why would you do that? My eyes. Oh wait, we can use two fairy for the no. You 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 is that fine no they're gonna be stronger than her does this party work i don't know this, it doesn't right because she's supposed to yeah yeah yeah, yeah. We do, we just did this one, I guess. That's kind of my go-to. That's kind of the only party I have when I want the green. I mean, what about him? Is he good? What role does he take? Mm. I've said that reference to like 25 YouTubers. This is the second time somebody actually got it. Oh my God, I can't believe this. <laughs> I, I feel so I feel so uh positively brain brain rotten right now. <laughs> but yeah, that's uh yeah. I mean uh, I don't know. It's it's kind of an old scene, right? It's kind of, it's kind of an old anime, so I don't blame them for for not knowing that yes, yes, yeah. We're we're like we're we're intense weeps here. <laughs> But yes, yes, welcome in, welcome in. I am, I'm, I'm, I'm glad, I'm glad I got it. 
Uh, remember how Ace Attorney, there would just be dead bodies of blood over them, the narration would call it grape juice! People thought it was censorship, but it was actually an in-joke. Oh my god. Uh, the only, I think Ace Attorney is pretty interesting, but the only Ace Attorney I played was the crossover between Ace Attorney and, Ace Attorney and um, Professor Layton. Because I love Professor Layton, and I loved that game. I loved that crossover game, and I was like, oh my god, maybe Ace Attorney isn't so bad. But I always thought I was too stupid for it, I don't know. Um, so I never played it, but yeah. Um, who else? I guess Sonetto. As a, like, fourth unit. Oh no, wait, she's also not- that's also not a good pick. What do we do? Uh, you. I don't know. It doesn't matter. I'll be fine. I'm sure. Maybe I'll be. Maybe I won't be fine because. It doesn't matter. We have jamming music. If I lose, we just got to hear the music more. I hear something. Your heart is beating so loud. Don't be so furious. Agents have guns. It's called common sense. We're probably fine. Forward! Target locked. Hey! Let's go! Easy peasy. Game no profile. I don't Game for babies. Game for babies. See my place full of benched! Alright, okay, well. Ah, we got a note! A slip found in the bush. Perhaps it was the monster's claw that pulled apart the soil and exposed us. We can't be certain. The music in here is a banger. So for everyone who's wondering what the hell we're doing, we're doing the we're doing this event now. I didn't want to on stream, but hey. Now we're doing it. <laughs> a plush apocalypse! A slip found in the in the brush? In the bush, you mean, right? It's a pitch black sharp tooth monster. It can swallow as a bear as if it were gobbling down candy. Well. Dun, dun. Cheap syrup. Let's go. Uh, wait, did I just do that? Never mind. I think that. I think. Was I. Huh? Is that the one? Oh, yeah, this one. Sorry. My bad. Welcome back, adventures. Welcome back. Welcome back. We have returned. <laughs> uh, I did watch Azumanga Dayo. I, I didn't. I didn't. I just it know escapes, the scene. Taking my precious collection away. I just know like the meme scenes, right? I know a lot of like insider or like meme scenes, but I actually I keep like I keep thinking I haven't actually watched a lot of anime, uh, because I don't know. I don't really keep up with new anime. I have seen some of the classics, but I feel like I'm really not I'm really not watching that much anime, which is kind of crazy. But it's like I don't I never knew where to watch anime and Crunchyroll used to be I I think it's much better now, but Crunchyroll used to be a little a little weird here. <laughs> like they didn't have a lot. Uh I think it's changed now though. Or I, I was thinking, or I, maybe they just didn't have the anime that I, you know, that I liked. And yeah, I don't know. I never knew where to watch anime. And so I kind of never really did. <laughs> now nah, there's no way to follow it. The trees it pushed down have blocked the path. This would take us some time. Mm. Hi, Linda. That was definitely you not your usual critter. Miss Two Fairy, what kind of traces did you find earlier? Most of them are left by medium and small critters. Claw marks of giant critters are clear, but few. There's probably one critter of such immense size. Besides, mm. we need to offer an explanation to that lady. I like how critter is literally the word for a small animal, right? And that thing was not a critter, <laughs> that's all I'm saying. Of course. They all look at the center of the chaos who seems to feel the gazes and turn back in confusion. Why are you all staring at me? Do I have something on my face or my clothes? Like me? No. 
Two fairy turns her face to the film crew. Young people bathed in fake blood form a circle discussing. Sad noises keep coming out of them, just like me for real. Camera! My camera, my god, the roll films are ruined too! They're there, Jennifer. Perhaps I can try piecing it together and fix it for you. Would it help you to feel better? No, you. I just you noticed. Every take I took. Oh my god. I was staring at this area the whole time. And I just noticed that it says Wadidas. Like WD does, right? And it has a little wing. It, it, it's Wadidas. <laughs> I just noticed that. See, you can't accuse me of looking at the... You can, can't accuse me of looking at the boobs anymore. If I don't notice that, like, yeah, all hope like is lost. Said. Don't be sad. Thanks to your generosity, none of us were injured. Blondie looks up and the brittle pieces of burnt camera fall to the ground from her hand. Uh, what did you just say? Free seas of Caribbean archipelago is an answer to anime. I, okay. Sure. I'm trying to comfort you. Sure. Don't glare at me. Actually, I think this is unnecessary, but they made me. The young man lowers his head, keeps his voice down, and tilts his head towards the people behind him. <clears throat> See? Behind me. The girl with the hat and the girl in the white. Huh? Uh, unnecessary? You think it's unnecessary? Do you have even the slightest idea of what you have destroyed? The blonde girl is shaking. Her face is clouded with anger. Her manicured nails nearly poke Horopedia's nose like sharpened little knives. Make your four eyes useful and look at these. What do you think they are? All right, calm down. Let's be reasonable. If you were mad because of your movie, I am really sorry. But at that very moment, I thought our safety mattered the most. Also, I have good news for you. This recorder is meant for taking daily family videos. The clips taken by it aren't nearly enough to be called a movie. So, to some extent, I just prevented you from shooting a disastrous movie. My god. If you are looking for any financial compensation, please talk to the girl with the hat. Oh, oh, come again? Who is going to make a disastrous movie? Uh, no, don't change the subject. Movies? <laughs> no, I'm not reaching over some movies. I don't care about this shit at all. Excuse me? He can get you out of trouble? It doesn't even come close. That was a limited collaboration product of Recorder and Lucas. You can only find three of these all over the world. Only three! It's more valuable than any jewelry or luxury handbags. The suede decoration on it alone can buy 200 of your stupid head, dumb. Oh my god. Shoot! My makeup! <laughs> what are you sticking there for? Go clean the broken trunks and bridges off the path. We have to get back to the cabin as soon as possible. I have no desire to catch- Oh my god! Our notebook is so cute! What the hell? That's so cute! Someone comes to her side. This is not a safe place for you. Get back to the town, find a hotel, and take a hot shower. Let's fucking go! Ow. <laughs> Ow! What the hell? Uh, hi, GSC! <laughs> Hello! Welcome Hello. in, Raiders! Hello! Hello. It's dead raining! Get back to town! Take a hot shower! Hello. Find a- find a- find a hotel! <laughs> Hello, 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 welcome in. Oh my god, oh my god, Jesus Christ. Did you have a Kaya emote and it's not even cursed? I cannot believe this. Are you guys seeing this? Was Are you seeing this? See how you can have Kaya emotes that are not cursed? Isn't that amazing? Isn't that crazy? <laughs> Hi, you call me MJ. All right, I'll try to remember that. <laughs> I'll try, I'll try, try to remember. Welcome in. You're a Kaya main? <gasps> Waste of Kaya emo. No, 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 no. You're just toxic. You're just, uh, you're just, to yeah, right? You're just, to yeah, you're just being toxic. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> but welcome in. That's so cool. Were you playing Genshin Impact then? Wait, 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 Were you playing wait, Genshin wait, Impact? Wait, 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 Genshin wait. Impact? Um, oh, you actually, I need to log in. I think I need to claim. I don't know. I need to log in. I, I need to log in either way. Uh, but welcome in. Hi. And thank you guys for the follows. Uh, let me, let me just, let me just, let me see. 
Uh, X Clipsa, thank you for the follow. Catboy Diluc, <laughs> nice, nice name, nice name. Uh, NJ, thank you very much. And Lamprey, Lam Lamprey Station, and Tangerine, hello, welcome in, welcome in, everybody. Hello, hello, how was your stream? Oh, you were playing Ni Reverse 1999. <gasps> oh, nice. We played Genshin earlier, but we were playing Reverse 1999 for right. Oh, we searched a category and decided to raid you. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Yeah, welcome in. Uh, we're we're doing the event story right now. I don't know if you guys have been doing that. It's the new, the, the you know, uh, Halloween in December uh, story. <laughs> because we get it later. I know that uh, I think like Chinese servers, they get all the stuff when it's supposed to be there. Uh, so we get a delay now, but yeah, we're doing the story. Um, I hope you've been doing that. If not, d obviously be aware of spoilers and all of that because we're a little bit into it already. Uh, not like super far, but you know, I don't know how long it is, but yeah. Um, I love the event story. Yes, I like it more than the uh, the previous one, but I think it's just because of the theme. I think I like this theme much more than the previous one, but yeah. Um... I love your model. Oh, thank you. How is Re99 so far? Uh, really nice. I really, really like it. I'm not done with the main story yet. Uh, I'm in chapter 3, I guess. Uh, so yeah, I haven't finished it yet. So this is technically... I don't know if this is like... It's not spoilers, I guess, because this is a side story. But it's supposed to be a side story of like chapter 4. So like the last chapter, right? Uh, and I haven't done that yet, so I'm not caught up with the main story, but I decided to do this today because it seems interesting, and yeah, uh, so so we're doing that instead. But yeah, I still have to catch up, mm, but I really, really like the whole theme, the vibe of Reverse. It's just so good, and it's so different from other games, and very, it's very eerie, but it's also a very, it's a very pretty game, right? It's a very appealing game, in my opinion. Yeah... I actually completed it the first day. Oh, that's that's fine though. If you like it, you like it. I totally understand. Yeah. Mm. Let's see. Da -da -da. I think it's very unique and lovely. Yeah, me too. Yes. Okay, what's your favorite unit though? Uh, so funny story. I did get Tooth Fairy in the current banner, but I. <laughs> I did like two I, I had like two rolls I was like I can't leave on two rolls I can't just have two rolls sitting there right uh, so I used them and I skipped them because I was like yeah well it's two rolls right and it was one of them was too fair and I was like oh my god this cannot be happening so now I, I have her but you know I wasn't really going for her but that's good uh, I will be going for Jessica though <laughs> the dear girl I really like the look of her but and uh, that's gonna be that's still gonna be a while, right? But I really, really like her. Uh, yeah. Do you have a favorite character? Yes. And my my current favorite character is Baby Blue. I love her aesthetic. She's so pretty, and her old looks so nice, and she's so cute, and also kind of scary. I like the I like the thing of this game where it's kind of cute and pretty, but at the same time, it's very disturbing. <laughs> Which is a really nice, I like, I like that, right? I like that, um, the contradiction of it looking so pretty and nice and beautiful. And, like, you have this, these cute units or, like, you know, balloon party or whatever her name is, right? Or whatever, right? Um, and then they're, like, actually freaking terrifying. And it's kind of scary. And they have the, the most disturbing voice lines and all of that. Uh, I just, something about that is just very, very nice. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Technically an apple main. Oh, I love I also love pickles. Yes, pickles are super cute. I just didn't want to roll on pickles. I haven't actually rolled on any banner significantly. I put like ten rolls into like each banner, ten to twenty rolls I think, into each banner. Um, and then obviously the stun standard banner. I got Eternity from the standard banner, which I'm really happy with. And, uh, yeah, and then Tooth Fairy was my first six star, five star? No, it's six star, right? I don't know. Highest rarity, whatever. And, yeah, so I have not really been rolling on the other banners, even though I think Pickles is very adorable. Uh, so, yeah, but I, I will definitely be rolling on Jessica. Hmm. 
one day I will build Poltergeist. Oh, I see, I see. And Regulus, yeah, and, and Tooth Fairy. Oh, yeah, good picks, good picks. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I want her to, I'm trying for Tooth Fairy, but I lost her 50-50. Oh, yeah, tonight. I'm just holding out more for her. I don't actually know how Pity System works. It might have been, I, I might have gotten Tooth Fairy because of the Pity System, but I really don't know how it works in this game. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, I, I'm kind of, I'm just, like, doing whatever. Uh, uh, I also want Jessica, yeah. I, 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 I'm so confused because they renamed her Jessica and she was apparently named Changeling in the, I guess, Chinese, on Chinese servers. But they named her Jessica for some reason. I don't know. Weird, right? Why are you shaking me? What did I do this time? Oh, I'm sure it's not. I'm sure it wasn't. I'm sure. I'm sure they didn't know. <laughs> I'm sure they didn't know. Sorry, our mod here is is uh, identifies as a white cat, <laughs> a white middle aged cat, and uh, so yeah. And everyone always shakes him. So be gentle, okay? Be mindful. Be gentle. <laughs> Uh, I was AFK, you want us a pretty, oh, thank you, and uh, Axolotl, yeah, 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 right, 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 uh, hi, Lamprey, uh, yes, I definitely am an Axolotl, uh -huh. <laughs> but yes, um, yes, but, but we, I mean, you know, you know, uh, but I can show you here, does an Axolotl have this tail, huh, no, I know there's an Axolotl on the side, but we don't mind that, right, Axolotl would not have this tail, right, no, it's not for consumption, go away, um, <laughs> But yes, again, welcome in everybody. We're gonna continue in a second. I just wanna let let me just catch up on chat, and then we can continue a little bit. Uh, sometimes I get distracted from the story. This is a thing that happens a lot. I get distracted, and then we talk about something for a little bit. Uh, but I try not to do that <laughs> too much. So yes, Voyager is also really eerie. Yeah, right. And I love Voyager. Voyager looks so pretty. But I'm not gonna roll on her because she's just a standard raid up, right? Uh, so I don't wanna I don't wanna roll on her. And I don't really play enough, I think, to get a lot of rolls. Uh, I don't know. But she's a super pretty unit. I love her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two fairy is so good. That's a great first limited six star. Oh, yes. Yeah, I still have to use her, but uh, she seems like a really good... I mean, she's supposed to be the best healer, right? Uh, which is which is really good. It's similar to that of Genshin. Just with lower high pity number, I think. Also a lot more standards. Yeah, mm-hmm. Her real name has always been Jessica. Oh, changing is a nickname. Okay, 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 I see. I'm also cats, so that's fine. We're good. Let's go. Cats unite. Middle age, sure. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Okay, okay, okay. Wow, wow, wow. Um, I will stop the shaking. You're fine. It's okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was a gentle shake. Yeah, you're good. You're good. You're good. Uh, yeah, you're referring to the axolotl on the side. I know, I know. It's, it's, we have, we literally have that because people keep saying I'm an axolotl, so I put the axolotl there. Uh, but yeah, I, I, I am, <laughs> wink, wink, I'm an axolotl too, totally. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Please enjoy the story. Yes, we will continue in a second. I go lurk. Yes, get some breakfast. Yes, 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 yes. Thank you again very much for the raid. Thanks for the warm welcome from your community. Of course, I'll take good care of them. I'll hold them gently like a hamburger. Yes, I shake with love, not with hate. Yes, Voyager is beloved. I got her early on before her banner, and I was like, "Oh yeah, that is so good." Congrats on that. Her old is so love. Oh, I want to see it. I haven't seen it. Uh, I think the olds are generally so pretty in this game. It's higher drop rate, shorter pity count. Yeah, I guess. Cat gang, let's go, let's go. All right, okay, let's see. My let's, students and I let's will continue. escort you to the main road at the edge of the woods and arrange a call for you. Mm -hmm, if mm -hmm. any of you have symptoms like an itchy throat or rising temperature, please buy some Robitussin or a similar drug at the nearest Robi pharmacy. Robitussin? Robitussin? <laughs> uh, no, I'm not leaving. The movie is not finished. As long as you take care of that big monster, I can continue with my project. Get that shit movie done. Oh my god, can she stop swearing? I'm gonna get demonetized. <laughs> we are a hamburger. Yes, you are. But we don't have the camera. 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 You dumb girl. Wow. Okay, Ugh, rude. You have no idea what we are doing here. 
So don't tell me what to do if the best you could do is handcraft some prop. Why is she so mean? Staying here is really not a wise choice for you. It is very dangerous and you can't protect yourselves. It's our right to stay here. You can't just Dude, her notebook Bella. is so pretty. Well, I also well, like her. Well, like I like her aesthetic well, well, and everything. Well, well, well. And I like the what he does. The what he does for for several reasons, you know, if you know what I'm saying. But um it that's kinda cute. That's a very cute detail. And I like the more colorful units as well, but she's so mean uh, for no reason. Uh, also, Lim Hong Ye, thank you very much for the for the follow. So <laughs> welcome in, welcome. In. I probably butchered the name. If I butcher any names, just let me know. Scream at me, but like in a nice way, okay? Yeah, 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 yeah. Mhm. Mm Typical blondie in a horror movie. Uh, actually, true. Yeah. Again, a reminder that Until Dawn exists, and it it reminds me a little bit of. Uh, I think her name was actually Jessica. The mean blonde girl in Until Dawn, I think, was called Jessica. But I might it might not it might be it might have been someone else, or it might not have been that name at all. I don't know. Don't ask me. It's been so long since that game ca came out, right? I'm enjoying her voice acting and story of the green lake. Oh, yes. The, the, or the voice acting in general. Yes. The voice acting, I think, in this game is absolutely great. And there's a few voice actors. Or I know one from Final Fantasy XIV because uh, if, you, if you didn't know, if you weren't aware, if you're new here, I play a lot of Final Fantasy XIV. <laughs> and there's one voice actor there that is also in that game. And I absolutely, she's absolutely adorable. I love her voice. Very, it's so good. Um, and she's here and she voices, uh, yeah, that one, right? <laughs> she voices Regulus and it's, I think her voice is so nice. And generally they have very, very good voice acting with the accents and everything. I love that. I love that they actually took voice actors that speak the language of the character that they're voicing, right? Yeah, it's really, really nice. Uh, also, Awakening Star Force, welcome in as well. Welcome in. She's so rude and mean to her. Yeah, and proceeds to shift them for potential reconciliation. Let's go. Let's go. I mean, the fan art, you know, we, we'll take the fan art anyway. It doesn't matter what's canon, you know. <laughs> you are, of course, entitled the right to stay, Miss Blani. She's like, okay, well, be, be, be a bitch then. <laughs> be a bitch then. But yeah, welcome in, guys. I hope you could keep I in hope mind everything's that you well. and your friends are in grave danger. The Green Lake campsite is not a place for fun. True, 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 true. You should stay with us for the sake of your safety. Also, like, the game is unapologetically gay by itself, so I really don't blame you because there's a lot of... There's a lot of, you know... Um, like gayness, <laughs> lesbian. The rain is getting heavier. I think we like they're canon. Cold. They're like literally Let's clean canon up the road lesbians. And head for the shout. Mm. Blondie girl falls silent for a brief moment and then storms away. All this gibberish to scare us off. Come here, Freddy. Go into the campsite and see if you can find some axes for us. Kids, if you find any teeth. Please pick them up and hand them to me. Uh -huh. Hurry up, Freddy! I'm freezing! Jesus. Blondie is rude because she's spoiled. Yeah, she's an entitled, rich, and wealthy. Yeah. Ah, there's a the jam music! Dude, I love the music. It's so good. A giant critter destroyed the path to the cottage. Tap here to view the status of the wooden bridge. Uh, this bridge is on the verge of collapse. Use dry wood to repair the bridge so that it can be used again. Okay. The woodlands. Fight of critters during the campsite during campsite inspections or complete campsite handbook tasks to get dry wood. Ah. Campground roads are decrepit. Use dry wood to fix up the road to get more dry wood. Drive of critters during the yeah. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, 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 okay. Dun, 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 dun. It's funny that the three male NPCs are named Jason, Freddy, and Michael. I know, right? Yeah. Waza well, said earlier that uh, they were the names were all kind of all references, right, to to like other horror media, uh, which is fun. <laughs> which is fun. I like that they do that. I really like that they take these real life stories or um, like existing stories and they kind of you know they hint at them. 
And I like that they take actual events in the real world and make them like fantasy kind of, right? Which is really, really interesting, really interesting concept. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Now that Blondie's not on screen, what color was her jacket inside and what was her eye color? <laughs> I have no idea, dude. I was—I keep looking at her hair because her hair is so impressive. I have no idea though. I know her shirt is green. <laughs> I know her shirt is like a greenish, like you know. Uh, that's it. We don't need to know more. That's all. And I know she's wearing like sh like uh, jeans, hot hot pants or whatever you call them, short jeans, right? That's it. We don't need to know more. The brand is our dancer in the main and the rain more sparse. Rather than rush on ahead, many creatures choose to pause here instead. The year to congestion, let's go. Her hair. No, I've actually looked at her hair a lot. It's 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 like fluffy and it satisfies me. I don't know. Wait, you cannot deploy her? The dentist is stretched thin, uh, thinking of suitable options. What the fuck does that even mean, game? What are you talking about? Uh, so this is kind of my... Oh, I can't even deploy... Oh, is she just gonna join us? No. What's gonna happen? Oh, wait. Oh, she's fixed. Never mind, she's in there. I'm stupid. <laughs> Was like, huh? Confirm. She's only level 10! Give me my unit! What the hell? Anyone offer your seat to the senior? But now we can see her abilities and her old. It's because you're a lesbianist, Arcanist? Yeah, yeah, the Yuri, the Yuri. I, the Yuri is strong, yeah. Okay, let's see. And flex one sec on, of confusion. Okay, so let's do this. Let's do Take this. Take it easy. And I guess I'm about. Watch out. I'll patch you up, I okay. And this is an alien city. Stop. <sighs> Mass healing. 80% of the castle's attack to all allies. Okay, healing effect gains an additional 30% critical rate. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. No I want to see it. Handle it gently. Come back to me. Oh, a little bit hot here. Her abilities are very pretty. Uh. <laughs> Mm, let's do this. Take it easy. Handle it gently. <laughs> Try for free. Try for free. Ah. Relax. My sword shot. No way. Bloody cross. Take it easy. Well, wow, this is an easy fight. We're not gonna see her old, but I running. really like her attacks because she <laughs> uses the fairies, right? Pride goes before the fall. I've been there. You better take it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All I see is what he does. Yeah, right. Note obtained! A slip found in a post-war cam. This messy scroll might seem unreadable, but examining it carefully should reveal a few anecdotes related to the Green Lake campsite. They push and shove each other begrudgingly, clearing the way for you. Let's go. So now we can repair this. Yippee! What's here? Okay, what's over here? Um, a slip found like every terrifying monster his past is a sorrowful tale even when Jack was a child his wits were far duller than those of his peers wait does that mean you were stupid <laughs> is that what they're saying politely okay so now we can do this yes okay 
I love her boobies. <laughs> Waza is Waza is a uh, Waza is a not a fan of uh, you know over sexualized women, and I'm a big fan of voluptuous uh, se sexualized women. <laughs> oh, this looks pretty. So we have clash. We have clash uh, very broken. irregularly. <laughs> Those are bite marks from small critters. They might have nested inside. Mm, I see jiggle physics. Does she? Does she have? I literally. I'm. I don't know. I. I don't really. I haven't really observed those to be honest. Like actually, which is surprising, right? Sonetto and Matilda, you're Italian. They're really cute together, though. They're really cute. Scholar mage even eats fairies like scholar for ether flow. It's true, actually. You have this a damn point. This power supply. Who'll pay for the bill? Maybe Who it pay has for the bill? Cables, or it's powered by some generation sets left by Zeno. Wait, stop here. Sometimes the, the the translations are just very out there, you know. To your right, by the corner of the stairway, there are three. No, at least three of them. They're getting closer. Blondie, take your friends away. Blondie. <laughs> It's just some cats. Don't worry about it. Um, this is still fine, right? I can also get my enemies with me in my mm. own. They're kind of cute, though. Something strange about these critters. Mm. They're so spirited. Maybe they ate something that had a special effect on Watch them. Watch out. Okay. I have worked hard. Just beating so loud. Talking out calms people down. Hmm. Get wrecked. Huh? Oh, oh my god. It came back to life. Oh, interesting. Hmm. That's how it always is with monsters and horror stories, true. So they have one rest. Is that what I'm saying? This is why I reminded everyone that no s this is why I remind everyone that no skill is more important than reloading your gun. What? Oh. Shoot it again. Don't let it get back up. Okay. All right. I hear something. Please don't worry about Radio waves are everywhere. Everywhere. Retreat. What? Welcome back, Ad Watchers. Welcome back. You missed nothing. Don't worry. We're almost done. I hear something. We skipped, we skipped the fight for you. Don't be so furious. Agents have gone. It's called Common Yippee! Sense. See? Oh, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. We should listen to what people say. Will's heart is beating so loud. Made it feel mine? Secrets always hide in careless words. I want to pause, like, take a screenshot and see what these words say, because I know they're German words. I want to see what they what they say. Get wrecked. Another button that's not in my hotbar. Okay, Frost, but that one is actually what like important. <laughs> that one is actually important. Situation like doesn't like need to happen again. Get in the habit of keeping your guns loaded. Stay low profile. Right. I don't want to be shunted to some radical department. Right. 
strange. I remember I left it here. Where's the camera? Hmm. Feels like the text translation was made for someone who uh, has written no English in resume. Are you looking Kinda. for something? I don't perhaps know. Perhaps I can help. Oh, perhaps I can help. Yeah, they have some spelling mistakes as no well. No one right? asks for your help. Go away. It's definitely not polished, but if you have nothing it's not to like do, I don't really mind. Up. I need a place to rest. So, Waza, the inside of her jacket, sure, I I looked at don't it. Worry, it's it's um it. it's green and the outside is purple. Uh, just saying. So, I definitely have looked at Let her. Let me right? give you a hand, Anne. That'd be great. The tools are in the closet. This won't take us long. No, but for real, is it me or is Anne just the changeling? Like she looks exactly, but it's from what I rem what I remember the changeling looking like. Try the cleaning is finally done. Anne and Sonetto walk around the living in the living area, handing out blankets they found in a cabinet. Michael sniffs, turning his eyes specu specu spec spec speculatively. So you guys are really oh. the investigators from the Saint Pavlov Foundation? What is Saint Pavlov Foundation? No way! You've never heard about St. Pavlov Foundation? St. Pavlov Foundation is an official institution that takes in and organizes arcanists, and my friends and I work for them. We will try our best to keep everyone here safe. I've never met a real one! What do you guys normally do? Taking humans for subject research? <gasps> Roaming around to snoop on the political parties? Are those stories true? Human subject research? Political parties? Pardon me, I don't follow you. <laughs> we will never do harm to any human. It's strictly stipulated. Save your bureaucratic rhetoric, little girl. I've read those books. I know you've done some dirty things. Tell me. Excuse me? <laughs> what is up with him? Shut your face, Michael. Yeah, I Michael. I'm to play the fool, not asking you to really be one. Don't bring disgrace on us for going to Vine State College with you. You are all students from Vine State College. Yes, faculty of filmmaking. This fool here is a chemistry student. The big guy over there is an art student on English literature and poetry. No, but you know what? I have been looking at a lot in like with her. I have been looking at her earrings a lot because I keep wondering if this is like supposed to be eggs, right? Or like the when you crack an egg, but the yolk is just green. Like I keep wondering what this is supposed to be or if this is just supposed to be, you know, just like a, like a shape with a color. And But I can't help but think that these are eggs with, with green egg yolk. Right? That's what I've been thinking about. It's one of my assignments to make a movie during the semester break. So I hired every useless meathead available and traveled all the way to this shoot just to shoot a stupid horror movie. Wow, she's so rude. Stupid horror movie? I thought you loved horror movies. The way he just asked stupid horror movies, I thought he was asking stupid horror. <laughs> I thought he was insulting her. Oh my god. Ew, don't disgust me. Who would possibly have interest in the movies filled with characters in sweat and dust and presenting zero romance or any nice costumes? Oh, God. You mean you are not interested in horror movies but determined to film one here? Blonnie pauses for a second, wrapping herself tighter in the blanket. You tell me. They are cliched, meaningless, but easy to make. They are the easiest option for this assignment. That's it. I've never liked any of them. Oh, well, I see. Well, hi, Tim. How are you? That's why you selected this awful script. All these beautiful but useless props and such an untrained cast. Oh, what did you say? Awful script? Well, I've read your script. It is illogical and dull. The conflicts are not strong enough. Or we can call it a classic, but in another word, it's stale. I really wonder, how did you get admitted to the filmmaking faculty? The admission criteria for Vine State College should be quite difficult to meet. Hmm. You! She has rich what parents, you that's how. you filmmaking? You're no one but a spawn of the Foundation like those bodyguards my daddy has! 
Come on, relax, Blonnie. Jason lifts one arm and rests it on the girl's shoulder. If your dad didn't sponsor the two library buildings, yep, exactly. he would not be here studying filmmaking. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a classic. My dad paid your friggin' school. And you look exactly like an arcanist when you get mad. Don't. It's not a good look. Say that again? Think you could take a punch from me? Oh, no, now they're fighting. It's just an eye shape, dearie. No, it's egg, it's I'm egg yolks, it's, it's, it's egg side. <laughs> so you can keep on pissing me off if life is being too good for you. Oh my god. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Normally you wouldn't be so mad over a little joke like this. Are you making a fuss now because your arcanist friends got your back? Jason, Jennifer is trying to finish a project. You shouldn't be mean to her. And Jennifer, yeah, can we de 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 es can we deescalate this? Isn't he your friend? I thought friends won't say hurtful words to each other. I don't understand. Is this the way people make friends in the outside world? <laughs> no. Yes, baby. Her words of medi mediation seem only inadequate and useless in front of Bonnie's anger. The young girl jumps onto her classmate like a furious cat. She pulls Jason's hair and ears, yelling in rage. What the fuck? I will knock off every tooth in your mouth. No, don't do and that. Don't do that. Crazy teeth collector. No, don't do that. Only no. in this way can your empty head remember how much I hate being called an arcanist. Oh God! Angry scratches appear in the man's face, and he seems equally mad. But you are all. But if he punches back, he's a woman beater, Although so he can't. I get it. Means to be a human, it won't change your identity. Oh god, he's making it worse. The Foundation's investigator does not plan to stand aside and watch. However much you despise us, many brilliant playwrights are arcanists. Mr. Horopedia, please stop making this worse. You jerk! Quiet. You tell him, Mom. You tell him. As two fairy knocks on the table with her glass jar, the sparkling creatures inside are frightened and start to hit the door. If you don't shut up now, I will shut you all up forever. <laughs> you tell the mom! <sighs> Miss Anne has a point. This is not how friends get along. Ladies and gentlemen, we are not here to fight. We need to cooperate. I don't expect you to love each other, but no more fights. I don't care whether you are arcanist or human. Now sit back on the sofa, everyone. So she's I'm a sorry, literal mom to party. I'm sorry too. I should have stopped them. <laughs> the young people sit back up to the couch. There's a strange, uncomfortable silence in the room. Blonnie, is Anne also recruited as an actress? She is not as restless, energetic as your classmates. No, she isn't. She's a local villager. We met by the edge of the woods. As well as Rod, the one okay. that plays the butcher. That's everyone in my crew. Now, if your curiosity has been well satisfied, leave. I need a break. Wait, where is Rod then? Rod didn't come with us, did he? Did they just leave him out in the in the freaking woods? Freddy, who is hiding in the corner, suddenly talks to Blondie in a low voice. Sorry to interrupt you when you're not in a good mood. Actually, R Rod didn't come here. He's hospitalized. Do you remember? Right, okay. He's not here? Then who played the butcher? Isn't he another actor you hired? Wait, what? Together with Anne in the town near the woods? <laughs> no. I've never looked for any other actors. Wait, and why is she hospitalized? What the, the only new actor I hired is Anne, because she looks almost like a twin to Anna, and Anna is absent because of her stomach flu. Oh, wait. Right. Anna is in hospital because of her stomach flu, which was a result of that toe bark stew she had with Rod. So, Rod... Rod was not in the car with us when we left. We... Mother of God. Th th that is... We've been with a butcher whose identity is unknown to all of us. 
Well, well, well. Jennifer, don't Someone worry. take the camera I'll out! Someone, it's just a prank! Take the camera out! Quickly! We need to film it! The cameraman never dies! Go, 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 go! How is this possible? When did this place get so dark? What time is it now? Hey, Freddy, stop whining and take a look at the clock! Okay, okay. Afternoon. Afternoon. 1 p.m. Outside the window, there's midnight darkness. Nobody has noticed when the sun was gone. Freddy looks up, his lips are shaking, his face has turned pale, and the expression on it is twisting strangely. Is that bro? No, that butcher is going to slaughter us. He is truly a cold-blooded murderer. <laughs> We're so fucked. Don't freak out, Freddy. A murderer is not someone you frequently meet. We're not shooting a horror movie. Yes, you are! Actually... <laughs> Actually... <laughs> He did the thing! He did the thing! He did the thing I wanted him to do! The actually! Actually, you are! Oh my god, dude. A giant monster? What a chat, a dude. I get it, I get it now. Nightfall? Anything here not like a horror movie? Right? Damn, aren't you being paranoid enough? Do you want the situation to get messier? The butcher so else, yeah. Really horror and Halloween on Christmas, yeah. It's because we get updates later. It's actually because we're like we're delayed, right? And uh, Asian servers get it like first, I guess, and then we get it later. You sit down. I will go check the electrical panel and fix it. It will bring back the light and restore your sanity. Mm, negative for me. Those who remain alone in a horror movie never end up safe and sound. That is if the true. If torture is really lingering outside the door, you will be his first blood. Although you are rude, impolite, and suspected to ancestry discrimination, <laughs> I suggest you to take someone with you for the sake of your safety. What? He really said you're racist, but like with arcanists, right? And humans. Oh my god. I'll back off, you troll. You troll. At least, like, at least he's not black. Because we know that, right? That's the rule, right? The black people are said to die first in the horror movie. I wish they had, like, done a... They had... They had... They could have done a reference to that, right? Because that's the thing. He really didn't, oh, wait, do I didn't that read that. purpose, did he? I think he shoved him, didn't he? What's on purpose? He said and did all the things you shouldn't be doing. Yeah, right? Split up you know, during a... a movie, yeah! His actions are like taking some sleeping pills, hugging the noose around his neck and shooting <laughs> himself in the head. It's true! It's true! Oh my god, dude. What is happening? <laughs> he really did all the tropes. A slip found a cabin. Some of them got wet. They're covered in small critter claw marks. Let's see. No, I feel sorry for that poor little thing. Its parents died and it became a test subject, suffering in the name of some war conspiracy. Oh god. Dun dun dun. Dun dun dun. dun, dun. Let's go. Let's see. Is he gonna be fine? Games for the brave. The young film crew has become silent and waiting. They lower the head, hoping this may come to an end. It has been seven minutes and 25 seconds since our bro the brave took the one-man mission. Our bro the brave? <laughs> I have never fixed a panel before. <laughs> what? Can anyone tell me if it's normal to take this long? I don't think so. From my experience in human society, it is not too long. If the device has been drastically destroyed, or the maintenance man is not familiar with that model, it will take longer time to fix. This is not unusual. We need to go outside to find him. No, just leave society. him. Aside from the butcher, he might confront some other troubles. Zanetto, you stay here with Miss Two Fairy. I will go find Jason with Horopedia. What? But why would you split up even more? No go all together. Not, we'll come back in five minutes. What if you don't? Just go. Why, why don't just all create all like powerful people go together? Then it means we are not in the kind of horror movie where misfortune only happens to low morphs. 
If we don't come back, please evacuate the whole campsite and contact rescue. Ah, it's fixed. Jason? Yeah, it's Jason. He fixed the lights. The lights ease people's minds, mind and expels their anxiety and fear. Michael stands up from the couch with a hint of desperation. He looks at the door with joy, hoping to see Jason walking in from there with open arms and mocking them for, chicken, for, for chickening. But the wait goes on and on and on. I, I can't stand it! This place sucks! I can't stay here for another second! If you just run out because you think this place sucks, I'm going to lose it. Pack your bags. We are done with that film! Everybody, get into the car with me! Let's go! Relax, man. Firstly, Lone Wolf disappears. Next, it will be the people who failed to escape. Now we must stick together. At least the rain was the origin of all these weird things. You shouldn't have walked into it. I remember the weather forecast said there won't be any rain in this area today. Like the story of Xeno Youth Force. We are in real danger now. Xeno? Xeno Armaments Engineering and Technology Academy? You know it? Are there anecdotes about Zeno in the town as well? They used to live here, in this cabin. <laughs> Enough! Stop! And stay away from those weirdos! We're leaving! Michael, we should listen to Burton and her friends and stay- <sighs> uh, Huh? If, if Rock can be fake, this whole campsite can also be an entire illusion! Someone put him down. He's getting delusional. You guys look normal, just like, like any ordinary. He's losing who it. Would possibly run into a place like this, but then you will infiltrate. Please calm down. We've only been trying to help. Oh my God! What the fuck? <laughs> I won't be deceived anymore! I will shoot you! Stay away from me! Why did you get a gun? One hand holding gun, the other seizing Anna in his arm. Michael takes a few steps back to reach the door. Jason is right! Our cadists are all insane! <laughs> I won't let you get into my car! You guys stay here and wait for the butcher to get you! Jesus Christ! He oh my lord! What the hell? Michael storms out into the rain with Anne. Damn it! How dare you leave without me? I like how he took Anne but not Blonnie. Like, huh? Blonnie, wait! It was it the, the was she supposed to be like a like a um what's the word? Uh huh. We can't let them leave like this. Hurry up! Oh, because he's racist, right? And she's an arcanist, right? Okay, I yeah. See, this is again so pretty. Dude, I love this. This looks so good. As time passes, Sonetto can feel the rain soaking her clothes. She wipes the water off her face and looks around. This is not good. It's too dark out here. Hardly visible. Michael must have driven out of here. But how did Blonnie disappear in the blink of an eye? They're all dead. <laughs> to the south. The skid marks and footprints all point to the south. Here are the claw marks of the critter. They might be in danger. We need to hurry up. Over here, I found her. <sighs> oh. Bloody. Oh God. Please stay still. We're coming for you. Miss Two Ferry and Horopedia, please follow them. Zanetta and I will handle this. Be careful. This creature is very malicious. Use this if needed. Oh, it's fairy dust! She hands over her golden glittering glass jar and quickly runs out of their sights with Horopedia. The rain has healed its wounds. It's getting stronger and harder to deal with. May the peace be with us. Um, save it as a wallpaper animation. Is that possible? I don't know if this is like this. I love this screen, yes. But uh, I know there's a wallpaper for the main screen, but I don't know about these illustrations. Mm. Mountain Villa Bandaged Man Murder Case from Detective Conan anime uh, anime has a similar setting. Ah, interesting. I've seen a bit of Detective Conan, but 
I, I don't think I've seen that one. But that was a good anime. <laughs> Alright, we got this. Finally, some interesting work. Turns into a mutant star bunkle. <laughs> oh my god, it looks so cute! Look, there's a little guy inside of there. After taking lethal damage for the first time and summons two mutant carbuncles. Okay. Alright. It's called common sense. Something. Oops, that was not where I want to move that, but hey. It, it matters not. It's fine, we'll be fine. Ouchie! terrifying and it's it is also terrified but it has a pen on its head it's so cute Whoa, I love it I hear something no wishes to me. agents have gone it's called common sense uh. Yippee. what is this Germany Retreat. what and then oh, waiting call? for party finder to fill. Oh my god. I love that. Do, wait, no. Uh, this one? Wait, no. This? 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 Who's hard? Is beating so loud? Hey, target locked. Radio waves are everywhere. It's gonna break! It's gonna break! Dun 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 Hey! This is Eagle! Target found! Made it to your mind? Fine! Lord! Take the offensive! Oh come on! Expectations. This stage has been uh, unlocked in surprise mode. Okay. What's the Germany one? Three ninety nine stories. Sometimes feels like a, a fever dream. It's true. It's true. What is it? Sad waiting. Why are you sad? I just learned that. Oh, this is Germany. Oh my God. Thank you. Thank you. I love that. <laughs> I resonate with that, yes. Um, it has a Franken Frankenstein castle? I thought this is only a story? What do you mean it has a Frankenstein? L like, there was a guy in there that like operated on some dude and like put him back, put like, like that? Or is it just a scary castle? It was soaked in rain radio. Fortunately, the handwriting on it isn't completely obscure, obscured. Uh. Deformed bones pierce through flesh and skin, crying and howling all the night long beneath the water's surface. Quiet came the angry shout from the man holding the medicine box. I have no idea what any of that meant, but sure. The sound of rain, a crash, a loud rumble, and then the crackling of flames. The writhing musicians invite you to play with them. Decline? Okay. Oh, she's fixed again, all right. Dental checkup. I think it is. I have two healers, so I'm an idiot. Their car hit something and then exploded. <laughs> There's no one in the car, but the keys seem to be here. In there. What's this? Watch out. 
They were drawn to the sound of the explosion. Get ready for a fight. Um. Relax. Whose heart is beating so loud? No worries. Whose heart is beating so loud? Please, don't resist. It'll be fine. Don't be so furious. Radio waves are everywhere. Hey, I'm the support staff. There are bad influence. Why are you breathing so heavily? I'm worried. Mm. Uh. Um. Whose heart is beating so loud? Radio waves are everywhere. Talking out calms people down. Supplies. I don't need them. I'm good. Wait, I want to save that. Relax. I hear something. Never mind. Let's do this and then this. I hear something. Agents have gone. It's called common sense. Get wrecked. No fool wishes to me. Oh, now I can see your ult. Okay, okay, okay. I'm ready. I'm ready. Hold up. Give me. Let me do this. Whose heart is beating so loud? Mine. Oh, okay. Hmm. Wait, can I like Retreat. make it slow? Let's go. Oh, it's all in slow motion. That's terrifying. <laughs> that is terrifying and really cool. No worries. I hear something. Relax. Please, don't resist. Agents have gone. It's called common sense. Stay low Yippee. profile. Yippee. I don't want to be shunted to some radical department. Just a scary castle named Frankenstein Castle. Oh, an IRL friend living in Frankfurt told me about it. Oh, interesting. Yeah, I didn't know that. I did not know that. Did you know that you can buy VTuber design from Etsy? Yes, you can You can buy uh, VTuber designs from a lot of places, like Fiverr, Etsy. Pretty sure people on Kofi are also offering somewhere. Um, I mean, I think usually people go to Twitter, but yeah, there's definitely a lot of offers. But you, you kind of need to be careful. I think on Etsy as much as on Fiverr, Especially now with AI art, you kind of need to be very careful that you don't get AI art because, yeah, uh, that's definitely a problem on those platforms. But that's always been the case. And, like, there's obviously also scam artists. I would be really careful on those. Like, especially the two platforms, like, especially Etsy and Fiverr. It's kind of like, mm, uh, you know. Also, hi, good bar. Hello. How's it going? Twitter or scam? Yeah, got AI art once. Yeah, it's really sad. That that stuff, I just can't. I I can't with that. You add a rest to the movement. Whatever that means. Whatever that means. Alright. A group of young explorers appeared. They were not good friends, but were not kind-hearted. Jack plunged into the water, silently sinking, like a giant rock. 
Dun, dun, dun. Dun, 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 dun. Wait, there's something here. Campsite handbook. Oh. Nice. Is there anything lurking in the distance? No. Nope. Hi, good boy! <laughs> How's it going? In the toffee jar. I want toffees. Oh. Med everywhere hurts. Did I get pulled into pieces or put pieces? What is happening? Lonnie, you're awake. I have just given you first aid for the wounds. For now, we will have to wait for Miss Toothberry to administrate a thorough treatment when she comes back. Huh? Don't worry. She's very professional and skillful. You won't feel any pain in the process. Am I... am I in the cabin? Th then I'm not dead! Good! I'm not dead! You are safe. The critter is gone. Don't worry. Follow me. Oh, yeah, yeah. Take a deep breath. Hold my hand. Another deep breath. Lonnie gradually comes down, calms down. Yet her hands are still trembling. Do you feel better now? Thank you. I feel much better now. Oh, Anne! Where is she? Did she get hurt? We didn't find her in the woods. Wasn't she in Michael's car? No, she wasn't. She jumped off. She saw me being attacked by the critter and jumped out from the side window. Oh no. Huh? The butcher. He must have taken in. Must be with him. I, I saw him too. He was walking towards her. Just like what would happen in a horror movie. It's okay. Here, take my hand. We know where she is now. This is good. We will get her back safe and sound. Okay, mm. I, I understand. The wooden door once again opens with squeaky noises. Miss Tooth Fairy, you're back. Where is Michael? They have gone. She took a chain of keys out of her pocket and put it on the table. We are not able to catch up and intercept the car. It crashed on the, the edge of the woods in front of us. Crashed on the edge of okay. the woods? What do you mean? I don't know either. The car was about to rush out of the woods, and then we heard a huge crushing sound. The front section was squeezed together, and the rear wheels were lifted in the air. And there was an explosion. Uh huh? Looks like the car was crashing into an invisible wall. They they hit the alpha wall. <laughs> it happened oh, right no. in front of us. Too quick and too astonishing. Wait, so they're fucking dead? We got to the car. The fire caused by the explosion was being extinguished by the rain. We found no one but this key. Uh. Is it yours, Bonnie? No. Never seen it before. I always have some decorations or a doll attached to the keychain. This one is rusty and too plain. It smells weird, too. Like dirt. Anything special? No. Neither mark nor labels. We didn't find anything to match it in the car. First the lone wolf, then the people who failed to escape. Scam artist and cursed art. Yeah, no, I think it's especially bad if um, people use AI and they sell AI. Because first of all, they didn't make that themselves. Like, you didn't make that. You didn't create that. You, Yeah, you put out some words into a, you know, into a thingy, into a bot, but that you didn't make that. And second, it's like... Yeah, like you you pay for you pay for art right you pay for something to be specifically created for you and then someone just puts a prompt in and then whatever you know whatever is the best that you kind of get out of that is is the thing you get so it's like you ca you can't do a very specific design in ai that just doesn't work 
Like if I asked for someone to put my design into into like an uh, or make AI art, right? Of that, uh, it wouldn't work. You can't you can't really do that, right? Uh, because because the specifics of my design or like other other designs of characters, they're never going to be accurate unless you take a you take like a reference picture and you just kind of overlay it with another style, I guess, which works, but then that's not art, that's literally just taking the reference and just like, basically you're tracing it, right? As, except you're not tracing it because you're not doing anything, <laughs> you know? But yeah, I just, and then pay, and like making people pay for that is just scummy as hell. Things are getting too complicated, but there's one thing that I am certain of. We are now caught in a dangerously and classically plotted horror movie. Yep, but also alpha walls, so you're in a video game. After taking a break, they light a fire to warm the space. That means Anne jumped off the car in order to save Blonnie from the critter's attack. Then she got lost. According to Blonnie, the last thing she saw was the approaching butcher from the woods. Hmm. She's in great danger. We must act swiftly to save her. Also, we need to turn this cabin into a security base for the upcoming battles. Horopedia and I will rescue Anne. He's a horror movie expert and it will be of great help. In the meantime, you and Sonetto stay here to take care of Blonnie and to secure this room. I will take good care of her. The group splits into two halves. The one saying, staying in the cavern, say, what? The one saying in the cavern, I think it's meant to say staying in the cavern starts to work. Ow! This hurts! Please bear with me for a minute. The wounds caused by critters are prone to tetanus. I need to thoroughly sterilize them. How about some painkillers? Give me some! I'm very sorry. I don't have any with me. You, didn't you say your treatment wouldn't be painful? I'm terribly sorry for what you're going through, but this is not the typical kind of treatment that we used to receive from her. How did she do it then? She would... Sonetta looks at Mrs. Toothfairy with hesitation. She pauses until she sees the letter, gives her a nod of permission. She would ask us to take the Tooth Fairies, that is, those golden elves in the glass jar. Oh, eat them? Ew. Blonnie is good. The ship is sailing. Maybe, maybe we're gonna see. I don't know. I don't know. Um, prompting the audience to AI. The results we get, we edit a bit. Uh, yeah, I'm just, I'm, I'm, uh, very strongly against. Well, I mean, I'm, I'm strongly against using AI, uh, for art purposes and monetizing it. Uh, same with like voice acting I am very or like deep fake stuff like that it can be insanely problematic it can be very bad I think monetizing it is uh, just wrong I think there's a lot of problems with uh, the ethnicity ethnicity no that's not the word like it's not authentic and it's not um, it's not what I consider, I don't consider it art, I call it ethic, yes, the, uh, the ethicalness, is that the word? I think so. Um, yeah, I, I don't consider it like actual art because the definition of art is not putting a prompt into something and letting the machine do something. Uh, but, you know, that's another thing. Uh, there is a distinction in, in art between illustrations and art, I guess, as well. Uh, some people are very... I'm, I'm not that strict about it, but there's a difference in that too, I guess. Uh, yeah, I just don't. I'm not a fan of that at all. Because, mo like, the, the thing is, like, most my problem... I think it's a great... I think it can be great. I think it's a very interesting tool... I think it's crazy that we can do that, that we have so much, that, that we just have so much knowledge, that we have the capacity to uh, have machine learning. And it can definitely be used for good things. 
but the the thing is it is used for very bad things and i know that everything can kind of every good thing can also be used for a bad thing kind of right uh and every technological advancement can be used for bad stuff and that's not the fault of the thing itself but here in this case in case of like ai art for example the thing itself um to me is kind of bad in itself because it takes it basically steals and if if the if the baseline of this tool is to learn from like from people's works that have not uh, that have not consented to their work being used i think that you could argue that the thing in itself is already negative to a certain degree uh, so that is where I say, okay, well, I think I think the tool in itself is a problem. Uh, so yeah, that that is my my stance on on that. Uh, but yeah, it's certainly a difficult difficult topic. And again, I will not say that it's not super interesting and it, that I don't think that it's a really cool tool. Uh, but there there's a lot of problems that come with it, and I just I can't condone as someone that loves art and that is like an ins aspiring artist basically um i just can't condone it myself it's yeah i there's a lot of there's a lot of things with it that that i just don't like they're effective in treating toothache and other oral diseases but also can be used to reduce inflammation stimulates wound healing and relieve headaches where can i get these fairies how long is this event uh i have no idea Many hours worth, probably. I don't know. You mean to eat this? Uh, yes. And it actually tastes pretty nice. Like mint and flavored dried plum. Let's go it's, eat the fairies. It just looks a bit unconventional. You would go as far as to eat this shit. Please, stretch your legs. I need to sterilize the inner thighs. Excuse me? Why? Hello? <laughs> Hello? What? Excuse me? The thought? What? Okay, fine. I will take that. Bring me the little elfling. Sorry, Blunny. You can't eat tooth fairies as a treatment. Why can't I? Of course I can. I will just put it in my mouth and swallow it with my eyes closed. It's kind of weird that they like... I mean, I think the fairies live. They're still alive. This right? is not about you. It is my own rule of treatment. I have specific treatments for humans and arcanists correspondingly. Through our contact so far, I got to know that you don't consider yourself as an arcanist, and that's why I will not treat you as one. Oh, shit. Are you upset about what I said? I, I owe you an apology. I shouldn't have been rude to arcanists in front of you. I know it hurt your feelings. I was not myself. I chose to live amongst humans, chose to be their friends, to be a different arcanist. I thought in this way, I would be taken in as one of them. But as you see, when things come to a critical moment, they run away without me. It was my car that they drove to escape. And yet they called me a freak and left me here to die. <sighs> Funny, isn't it? Sad story. I feel sorry for you, but still, you can't take the tooth fairies. Is this a punishment for what I have done? I can't feed you the tooth fairies only because you still think you are a human. You don't recognize the behavior of your human classmates, but still want to be on this side and be one of them. Okay. The wounds are packed. Oh, ready? She just I, said I okay. I feel a thing. I've applied carbuncle growth promoter. It will paralyze, sedate, and accelerate your cell regeneration. Isn't that a medicine for arcanists? It is a prescription approved by the medicine examination supervised by Campbell. In this case, it doesn't violate my rule. You could have applied this earlier and spared me the pain. I don't rely on painkillers. I am an excellent doctor. Minimizing patients' pain is of course my forte. When kids can't suppress their pain, I normally sing for them to ease their pain. Aww. But you didn't sing for me. <laughs> You're because not you a didn't kid. want to? Huh? Maybe. I confess, what you didn't say at first was really annoying. Arcanists and humans always act as if they were a one merged entity. 
But we all know how lines have been drawn between their own people and the others. You grew up among humans, and you learned to look away from the truth as they did. Oh, but you do react better to the medicine for arcanists. Your blood is bringing you a good outcome. Look. Mm, because of chat GPD, many complain of chat GPD people use the literature of artists without their knowledge. Yeah, and feed AI to learn. That's another problem. I think um, one of the biggest problems that a lot of people are probably not aware of in, in that specific case is that um, now there's a problem. It's actually a big problem now in schools and in unis and like, you know, college, all of that. Where... Um, I've seen people, like, obviously, students would be able to use uh, ChatGPD to just write their assignment. That's a problem. But the other side of the problem is that now, teachers, like, I've seen, I've seen, um, like, people on Twitter saying, Oh, um, I, I, there, there was a teacher, like, in my school or whatever, right? And um, they accused me of writing this with chat gpt and i didn't write it but they they the teacher ran the text through a an ai detector tool and then said it was chat it was written by ai like the the tool said oh this this has been made with uh th there's a high probability right there's a high probability this has been made with ai this has been written with ai and it wasn't apparently like i of course i don't know but this is probably it, this is probably more relevant than you think in in these you know um educational institutions where now this it, now no one knows how to deal with it because can you trust a tool that is supposed to figure out if something is written with ai or not how would you ever be able to detect that and then the problem is like for both teachers and students because students can now just write something with AI and how, how would teachers find that out? Or students could be accused of writing something with AI when maybe they didn't even do that. So there's, there's this whole aspect with that particular case. And it's, th this is a thing with every single aspect of AI. There is always something where you have to worry that it's misused and you can't, like, there is no way of actually applying laws to it in, in a way that's like universally, like, how are we going to do that, right? So that's a major problem. It, it's the same thing with like, um, not safe for work stuff, like nudity, uh, where you can just use AI to overwrite a, an image of a person, like a pho photograph of a person, and you can overwrite it um, and make AI basically undress the person and just you know put a naked body on them and everyone can just use that basically uh and and some tools are just okay with that and i think that's crazy right and and how are you ever gonna monitor that right how are you ever gonna monitor but that actually i think falls into um something like a category that is illegal that can be punished if you do something like this uh, with photographs but yeah it's it's just crazy to think about all the negative aspects of it and how many problems it can actually cause uh, i think especially like the chat gpd school thing is a uh, is or you know uh any educational institution that that is like something that uh, probably has a big impact and i think a lot of people currently having the discussion are not even aware of stuff like that because you know uh, a lot of people are not in school anymore whatever uh, so yeah, there's a lot, I mean, there's a lot to talk about and everyone has kind of their opinion, but, uh, I think there's points to make that, make that inherently, because you're, you're, you're essentially stealing from existing sources and, uh, I think, I think that makes it, that just makes it uh, to some degree bad in itself. Uh, but yeah, I know people would there's probably people that would argue against that and would be like well, you know It's just trained on it. It's just learning from it. That doesn't mean that it like, you know I know that just steals but to me that's kind of that is kind of stealing so uh, Like, you know, it's 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 about like what word do we use for the act of what is actually happening? I don't think it matters. I think you know But hey, she grind up a carvey. Yeah, she's she's a summoner and the and the um and a scholar. Stories 18 chapters long. Rest of the event is side lore. Event uptime is 40 more days. It, I feel like they have a long... They have a pretty long event time. 
Right? I feel like the, the events are up for a very long time. Put it in mouth, swallow with eyes closed. Um, hmm. That's how sage weapons are made! Uh, for rewards, he basically burns stamina and max stiff uh, on last boss daily. Mm, okay, and get currency, yeah. Make the kids do all the work at school. No uh, no more homework. Hold on. This AI thing is starting to sound good. Uh, I mean, yeah, that's the thing, right? If you don't want to write an essay now, you can just put it into ChatGPT and ChatGPT will, and you can just tell it, hey, can you write this essay about this and that for me? And then ChatGPT will do it and you can just all write it. But that is insane to me. Because now, suddenly, the whole point of school is like, well, what, you know, at least in the subjects that require you to write essays and write up something. Uh, it also, I think ChatGPT might be able to solve math problems for you. I'm not sure. Or, or things like that. Uh, but I don't know about that. I haven't looked into it. But I know the whole essay thing, I've seen that be a problem. So at least, like, I'm, I'm sure of that being a thing. Uh, for everything else, I don't know. But that's, it's, it's just crazy to me. And it's sad to me. But we live in a dystopia, right? So... <laughs> <laughs> you know, <laughs> right? That's just. I guess. Uh, I guess it is what it is. I, I guess it is what it is. But yeah, same as Genshin. Three weeks per banner. Yeah, but the are the events usually that long though? Like the banners, yeah. But the events, maybe I maybe I haven't played Genshin in in too long. <laughs> I just didn't write the essay. Yeah, kind of that. In right? another half an hour, your wounds will be fully recovered. By then. You will be able to jump and run freely, as if you were never hurt. Nice. However you feel about your ancestry, it is helping you out. But again, like, uh, as you say, like, I didn't write the essay, we didn't have chat GPD back then. It's like, I mean, uh, you, uh, students and people will always find a way to make something negative, to use something for something negative. Um... That's just how it is, right? And and again, this is kind of the question of is the tool inherently bad or is it the people that are the problem that are using it for bad things, which happens everywhere all the time. If there is something like it's like rule 34, except not it's not porn, but it's actually so, it's used for something bad, right? And th that's always going to be a thing like I, you know, uh, very aware of that, but it it, it, it the, the question is more about is this tool a a actually you know is it actually inherently negative my wounds a good outcome Lonnie shocked by what she heard watches Tooth Theory wrapping up her devices and walking towards the Miss stairs Tooth Theory, please wait if what Mr. Horopedia has said is true it's dangerous for us to split up the three of us should stay together. True. It will take another 25 minutes for her legs to fully recover. If the situation were to develop based on the rules of horror movies, at this stage, I am safe. Don't worry about me. <laughs> okay. I see. Have you also done a lot of research about this genre? Mm, not a lot. I just browsed the secret notebook left by Horopedia in the infirmary. <laughs> I covered okay. him from the instructors to keep his notebook. Since then, we became friends. Keep... keep things from the instructors? Did you do this a lot? Not really. The rules were extremely strict. Except for Horopedia, I only had Virgin as a frequent guest. She pretended that she got a stomachache, lying in bed for half a class. She took many toffees when she left. <laughs> Timekeeper... faked her illness? Wow! Ah, and that also explains her toffee. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't know that. Cute. It seems I need to apologize to Virgin for letting out her secret. Aww. But thank goodness you are on her side now. Our negligence didn't cause much damage. That's cute. All events in 399 themed after patch, so all the uh, eight different tabs in patch page are events, I guess, yeah. Different timings, yeah. I'm alright now, what should we do next? As promised to Verdon, we need to fix this building and lay traps in the surrounding area to make it a safe house. Got it. Also, hi Grimlock! How are you doing? How's it going? I come to help too. Cabin has been abandoned for years. Have a look around, make sure it's safe. 
Uh, perimeter that could be reinforced using dry wards. Sturdy facilities can keep monsters at bay while enabling all the benefits of a same home. safe home. Closet emitting the smell of rainwater. Critical rate. Oh, there's still room for improvement. Use more dry wood to continue repairs. Okay. So we want to upgrade these. I see. The yard in front of the cabin is going to be empty. Traps should be something. Use dry wood to craft traps. Traps have additional effects and can offer aid during battles. Ooh. Ooh. Craft and traps must be set in the yard before they take effect. They can be used repeatedly. Only one trap can be set in the yard. Different traps can be set to deal with different situations, so choose wisely. Use dry wood to craft all kinds of traps. Okay. Alright. Bum bum. I'm gonna just upgrade all of these. Like once, I guess. Like one after each other. I don't know. Also, hi, Salary. Thank you for the headphones. Thank you, thank you, thank you. How are you? The power went out today because someone crashed into the box that powers the neighborhood. Oh my god. That is so unfortunate. <laughs> I hope it comes back soon. I hope they can fix it soon. That's so that's that's unfortunate though. Man. Um can I upgrade them all once? Yeah, right. Um, what is this thing in? Critical rate. Oh no, now it's a hundred. Is it a hundred everywhere now? Yes, okay. Flame. Bum 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 bum. Um, this one. Dun, dun, dun. The last girl. Traps can be set in all stages. After a trap is set, this marker will, dis will be displayed here. All right. Okay. Let's try this. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> the last girl normally has two categories. From what my dad told me, the damage is pretty bad, so I don't know if they're gonna be able to fix it. Oh. Oh. I mean, they kinda have to, right? <laughs> if it's like power for the whole neighborhood, uh, and that is a bi that is a big deal. I hope they get I hope they get to do that soon. I don't know what your situation is, like how how good the infrastructure is, but um. That's kind of crazy. It's so unfortunate. Like, I hope the person is okay. <laughs> First of all, I hope the person's okay. If it was, like, bad damage. But, um... Also, like, it's it's unfortunate they, that they crashed right into that thing, right? Hi, Hazel. Mr. Rob, when's the 516 stream? I don't know. I don't know. I, I need to figure that out. There's a uh, there's a few things I need to do. Maybe after Christmas, actually. I I don't know if I'll play it like super soon. Um, yeah. There was like uh, I need to like I need to see. <laughs> I need to manage my my games that I buy and all of that. Uh, I'm gonna see. Probably not like super soon. Like not maybe not this month, but I'm gonna see. It's kind of whack that they just they just released it. Like, it's cool. It's a really cool thing. It's a nice surprise. But uh, now I'm like, oh, God. Now I feel pressure to play it like s as soon as possible. But I'm going to wait at least a little bit. Yeah. Also, hi, Lemon Schneider, my beloved. Yeah, soon TM. She's going to be back. She's soon TM. Mm -hmm. Half the neighborhood less, less power. Yeah, I hope they fix it soon. Because that, that is a big deal. And they should be getting to that like as soon as possible. When's Torgal in 14? I know, right? I need him. I need him. He's the exemplar of the first kind. Pure, innocent, and mild like a virgin. The it didn't say that in the text. More condescending, erudite, and sophisticated. God damn it. I, it he said like a and then they, they, they censored him because, yeah, why would you? But it didn't even say like a virgin in the text down below. 
How dare you, game? This category can easily tackle any difficulties and make sensible choices, like our Miss Tooth Fairy. Oh my god. They are god. all good girls, approved by society. Therefore, people reward them with the privilege to survive. The Critter's Claw okay. and the Butcher's Cleaver will never hurt them or kill them. So what do you mean? I mean, please don't worry. It will be fine. She is safe. She is particularly okay. safe before we die. But if we lose her, the probability of our death will go up, 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 and up. Okay. Very comforting. Yeah, right? Behind the bushes, a tract of grass is flattened as if something heavy was Wait. there. The carcass of the giant critter is missing. Maybe it's not totally dead and has crawled back to its den? Hmm. It was dead. I've checked and there was no way it could survive. Here in the mud. It's the fur... Oh, also, what's this? A note found under the scattered fur. When we found it, that large body has had disappeared. A note? That's weird. Hey, look! It's the butcher's footprints! Let's follow it. A mossy cave. Hmm. The footprints disappear. The soil here is less moisturized than the outside, so the footprints are barely left. The smell. I think I've smelt this before. The key. This is the smell of the key. The moss here is definitely special. We need to take some samples back for Miss Tooth Fairy. Burton? Is that you? It's Anne's voice. <gasps> she must be here. Anne, can you hear me? When I woke up, it was pitch black. It scared me. Understandable. That's understandable. Yeah, that sucks. I would be so... I would be so upset. I wouldn't know what to do. <laughs> I'm here! I'm like... Below you! Below? Huh? A hidden entrance grants burden as she splits and pushes the weeds and mosses aside. And this is where Anne's voice comes out. The pit is deliberately dug. The soil here is dry and granular. This was originally a cave. She is hidden inside. Horopedia rubs the soil with two fingers to take out the white moss inside and puts it in a sample bag. I see you. Anna stands on her toes and tries hard to reach Burden's hand. Stay strong and take my hands. I will pull you out. They're holding hands? Oh my god. It's not a deep cave as the girl as the girl put up there pulls with full strength. The one down there gets out. They both fall to the, fall to the ground. Oh, thank you. I Aww. thought I would die in there. Where are the others? Are they alright? Did someone go rescue them as well? We saved Blonnie, but didn't find any of the boys. Don't worry, we will do our We don't care about them. the boys. Get the boys out of here. If the girlies are fine, we're good. This is good news. Jennifer is safe now. The butcher threw me into that pit and left. I don't know when he'd be back. Perhaps any time now. Anna looks into the depths of the forest restlessly. Burton, we have to get out of here now. Uh, the hunter is good at approaching his prey in silence. <sighs> The sound of heavy breathing suddenly comes from behind, like that in many other horror stories. With the knife close to her neck, the girl can't help but tremble in fear. Just as the classic pot goes, this is the right timing. Step back. He can't kill you, but he might hurt you. No, I will fight along this time. I can't be a burden to you now. Uh, okay. Like for real, for real? All facilities effects will take effect during battle. Tap here for an overview. Alright. Okay, I guess not. I guess not for real, for real. Um, you, you. Are you gonna be good? I also got Charlie. I forgot about that. Did I choose Charlie? What does she do again? Probably. Thank 
Central Checker. There he is. He said like Virgil, cute Virgil theme. Oh my god, stop it. <laughs> How dare you? Handle it, Jen. Take it easy. Handle it, Jen. Here's something fun for you. Try for free. Try for free. This is the sparkle team. <laughs> they all have like sparkle abilities. Dude, holy crap. Ha, that's what you've got. Huh? I, I, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh my god. Run! Run away from him! Don't let him catch you! I was like, what the hell is when I walked out of my room? I was like, no, but I'm staying in my room. Like a horror movie. Like earlier, all the lights here went out. Uh, in, like in the game, right? It was like that. Certified horror movie moment. Like a miracle, a brand strikes the knife all of a sudden so forcefully that the knife bounces out of the butcher's huge hand and lands a couple of meters that away. No! No! I won't allow it! A scream squeezes its way out of the young girl's throat. They start charging toward the knife at the same time. Oh god. Both of them stretch their arms and reach for the knife. Anne reaches for the knife first, followed by the clumsy butcher. Oh shit! In an instant she jumps up and pins him, I don't know, on the floor, I don't know. Oh my goodness! She just fucking killed him, holy shit! She's badass. A gust of moist, hot air blows off like, str like, str like a stream. <gasps> What the hell? He got wrecked. Sweat flows down her spine despite the coldness at night. The relief after the extreme tension makes the young girl shiver ceaselessly. The towering body under her shrinks like a balloon, quickly losing its air and blending in with the soil. A strong odor of beasts suddenly fills the you air. You can let go of me, Han. It's over. He disappeared. Oh, right. I know. I know. Yeah, you defeated him. Like a marvelous miracle. Wow. A miracle? The brave heart and the miserable death of the crazy criminal killed by his own weapon. This is the last girl. The last girl? Huh? Huh, huh, huh. Um, slip found in the, among jet black hair. It has a strong odor about it. it. Smells like a dead beast. Oh, what the hell? Dun, 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 Oh. Uh, when Jack returned his axe, let them know they had made a mistake. They begged for mercy, but it was too late. The moonlight didn't shine that Friday. Miss Fortune had found a new home. 
went. Plunged into. So did they try to kill him? And then he came back. And then he he was going to he he was going to kill them, or he killed them. Uh, the room was silent. Some something as white as snow was eating up all the candy, whether inside the jar, outside the jar, black or white. Um. Okay. Do I have anything? No. No. Okay. Hoarding obsession. Oh boy. Oh boy. Hmm. A warehouse filled with bizarre little items. Puppets. A Ouija board. A witch a witchy board? A diary. That's not how you spell box. that's not how you spell Luigi board. <laughs> That's not how you spell that. How dare. To my forever love, Victoria. Here lies my lifelong secret. In the summer of 1973, I took the life of a young lady. Excuse me? Huh. Sounds like an intriguing story. Those kids will love it. The pity <laughs> is, I find no teeth here. A veggie board? Yeah. A Waluigi board, huh? Good. That'd make another trap. The cabin is more safely secured now. Now, take these boards to the east side of the house. We need to have that direction covered as well. <sighs> Damn it! What are you? Did you really draw this amount of strength and energy from this thin body? This is nothing compared to the training I received in the Foundation. Blani, it is okay to rest on the chair over there if you're feeling fatigued. Leave this to me. Before the kind-hearted girl finishes her words, someone else takes over the boards. Ladies, I found something in the attic. I brought them here- <gasps> Burton? Time- Timekeeper! It's Anne! She's safe! Good. Hmm? What? What's that behind her? I didn't know there's still an army stationing here. No, huh? that's a cluster of monsters. Well, you can also call it an army. Awesome! How are we supposed to deal with them? We are so dead! I... You're fine. I can't run any further. Good. They've set traps in front of the cabin. Sonato, activate the trap. Prepare to engage. Just don't step on it, Anne. <laughs> don't step on it yourself, girl. Alright, what do I need? Flower and the... Uh, you, you... You... Eternity, she can solo it. Even though she's weaker. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Finally, some interesting work. Whose heart is beating so loud? Talking out calms people down. Agents have guns. It's called common sense. It's gonna break! It's gonna break! It's gonna break! <laughs> hey, I'm the support staff. I love the background. I don't know what it is. I think I'm just a sucker for like for cabins in the woods and like not in a scary sense. I, I I'm just in the sense of like comfy comfy wood cabin Maybe moment thing, right? I just love that. Um, there's too much health thingies here, hello? Too many health thingies. An eye for an eye. Oh, you deserve it! <laughs> Retreat, play! It's the right way! I can't make the call! 
Tooth for tooth? What are you, the tooth fairy, huh? Oh crap, we're like... An eye for an eye. A tooth for a tooth. Wait, hold up. An eye. A tooth for a tooth. Ah. We get it, we get it, we get it. Feel it pain and know with regret. Pay for thy sins with thy blood. Hilarious! God damn it. It's gonna break! It's gonna break! Resistance is futile. Made it to your mind? Shh. I hear something. Oh, you deserve it! Radio waves are everywhere. Let's go! Everywhere. Oh my god, it's a lizard! He ain't looking too good. Nice arms coming out of your uh, back. <laughs> huh. Look at so loud. We should listen like to what people mountain. say. Radio waves are everywhere. No fools wishes to me. Secrets always hide in careless words. Listen carefully. Get out of here. I wonder if his armpits are tingling. Ah, Frost, don't you need to go to bed and rest, huh? And what if I tell uh, what if I tell a certain someone that you're you're here right now, right? Mm -hmm. Let's get you to bed, old man. Don't be so furious. We should listen to what people talk about. I don't need this. Whatever. The scale of justice. Secrets always hide in careless words. Listen carefully. Thou shalt make an atonement for thy sin. I guess I need them for the spell, but the law is above all else. Yep. A tooth for a tooth. Fine. Pay for thy sins with thy blood. Oh, you deserve it. It's gonna break. It's gonna break. Hilarious. The damage, please. An eye for an eye. This is probably not going to be. Pay for thy sins with thy blood. Thank my water. It's gonna break. It's gonna break. Work hard. You're gonna be fine. Agents have gone. It's called Commissariat. Let's go. I don't want to. Yeah. Mm hmm. Uh, slip left by monster in a trap. Fortunately, we prepared the trap in advance and it really came in handy. Let's go. Let's see. Uh, that's where the giant rock lives. A foul smelling pool of water. On an emerald on a silver ring. What? Where is that? Where is it? What? Organized notes. Meat cleaver in hand. Wait, what? Axe. Meat cleaver? Naughty little trespassers. Sorrowful tale. Not good friends. 
Not kind-hearted. Unhappy childhood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jack plunged into the water. Sinking. Traumatic experience. Yeah, and then he like, he, he wants to avenge them. Moonlight didn't shine that Friday. Misfortune had found a new home. Black Friday. What? Huh? A sale? Did he get the axe on sale? Is that what I'm getting? Is that what we're... Is, is that... The, how is Black Friday the... Ugh, whatever. You know what? I know... I know they don't mean the Black Friday... The, like, the Amazon Black Friday, right? <laughs> but that's an interesting conclusion. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Can I update... Yes, let's do this. Friday 13th, that makes more sense, but oh my god. <laughs> Black Friday, let's go. A sale. I'm riding out Frost! Yeah, 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 yeah. I would if I could. I would, but I can't. I don't have, I don't have, uh, I don't have the socials. I'm, I'm like, I'm, I can't. You offered us the best odds. We have the last girl. Please don't say that. I'm not that good. It was pure luck. No, you are awesome. You struck away a knife with the branch and took the murderer's life with his own weapon. I mean, she's probably traumatized. I can't be wrong with your part sure. play here. You are the last girl. I should have noticed this earlier. You are gentle, simple, and kind-hearted enough to put yourself in danger to save others. No one is more suitable for this role than you. This is your part. Okay, now kiss. Good, good. From now on, I will stay right next to you because where you are is always going to be the safe place. Yeah, you better hold hands so you don't lose Jennifer. her. Blondie, I need to remind you that the character who relies on others always leads to a miserable end. Lost. Have you ever wondered why people dislike you? And promise me you will keep me safe with this special power of yours. This is good. Lonnie seems to be more relaxed now. She smiles a lot more as well. She's changing. Not bad. Miss Tooth Fairy, please take a look at this. A piece of moss with mud and a sour and earthy smell. It smells the same as the key. I found the smell in their car, as well as on the sofa in the cabin. Where did you get this? There's a special area near the woods, where the temperature and humidity levels are higher, so mosses are ubiquitous. Any signs of artificial cultivation? I'm not sure. This place has been deserted for so long. We haven't found any trace of human activities. After examining the moss and thinking in silence, Tooth Fairy nods confirm confirmedly. This is a potion. Like most moss made potions, it paralyzes the central neural system of humans. The subject will become impulsive, confused, and mad. They permeated the whole campsite with the rain, taking away the sanity from Jason, Freddy, and Michael, like what would happen in a horror movie. No surprise. Ordinary people would never behave as foolish as the main characters in a horror movie. It's said that a similar I smell is also I, found mm. on the Xeno Youth Force. Were they controlled by the moss here? I'm pretty sure they would though. Like, there's probably people that would do exactly the things you're not supposed to do. From building her to your awesome great development. Yeah, yeah. The the we're, the gay enthusiasts are definitely having a <laughs> having a good time right now. Um. Yeah, she's definitely having character development though. She has her Twitch account. Big send her a whisper. You won't. I don't know her. Yes. I don't. The changes of personality can be no, wait, one I of know the effects her name. of the moss. But you're right. I won't. So the moss <laughs> not only affects humans. It also works on arcanists. What about us? Why haven't we been affected? Time. It takes time. Humans perceive the world through the use of reason. They are the creature of logic and senses. Mm. However. They soon lose the sanity when they meet insanity. Arcanists are not the same. We were born with chaotic, mixed emotions. Our innate sensitivity to feelings and potion resistance Don't pet my head, <laughs> The Xeno Youth Force will stayed do here it. for an adequately long period to be contaminated. It will also affect us when the time comes. 
Perhaps we have lost our minds without realizing it. Fine, no, wait! Wait! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> I take it back. Ooh, what are these? I take it back. Like Why hasn't anyone told me about them? Someone called Hazel. Ask her if they be like roommates. I know, right? I found them in the attic. These tiny and exquisite items have a lot to dig into. Welcome back. Pity, I still haven't found a tooth. Um, what is that? Oh. Well, uh, slip found in an attic collection, stained with dirt and accompanied by a silver ring. Uh, let's go. Oh, silver ring. Let's try to organize these notes and get them back into the order we were. We might gleam some new information that way. I've organized them once before. Let's take a look. It's a classic camping horror story. Is there any other information you can glean from this? Not at the moment. There are two stories left. Let's take another look once we've gathered them all. Oh my god, what is that? The bride in her white dress wanders by the lake every night, searching for her beloved, searching for another happy bride. She looks like that bride from Bloodborne. Dun 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 dun. It's time to cleanse anew, my darling. At one of eighty for some people. Oh no, pain. She moved to our pets, and now, uh, well, no. Streamer doesn't have pets. Y'all heard that's not true. I need them. Why do you think I removed them? So I can have them. The young staff of the foundation are making deductions from the current situation. The city girl and the town girl lie in the sofa, in the sofa, snuggled up against each other, and fiddle with the clutter piled up on the table. Dude, they they went gay for like zero to a hundred. Look, they're trying to solve the problem, yet we can do nothing but fiddle around. Maybe I should have worked harder in college, so that I can at least understand a thing or two from the conversations. Don't worry, Jennifer. I don't understand any of what they said either. You are not alone. I'm here with you. I'm not like you. You literally don't know anything. I remember when we first met, you asked if everything I had on me. She's still mean. You grew up here, in a small town in the middle of nowhere. It's only normal that you don't know anything about the outside world. Never mind. She's kind of making but sense. I'm like, different. I I've been to big cities, I've gone to college, I've read books, I've pretended to be well adapted to this lifestyle. But in fact, I'm still ignorant, knowing nothing but empty pleasures. Okay, never mind. <laughs> uh, roommating? Yeah, right? Roommating? Yeah. Welcome back, Anne. My watchers. hair color gives away who I am. I'm a silly blondie. What do you mean? Don't speak of yourself like this, Jennifer. Yeah, Jennifer. Anne sits up, frowning with anxiety. She raises her voice. Oh, sorry. You're not silly. You're smart. You make your own movie with the script you wrote by yourself. You're pretty and kind, and you're the She's best She's not kind, though. Please don't hate yourself. I mean, we don't need to lie. We can, you know, we can be positive and don't need to lie. <laughs> Fine, I get it. But can you let go of my hand first? You're hurting me a bit. They're so gay! Oh, sorry. Are you going to be okay? Shall I get you some ointment for these red areas on your hand? My goodness. <laughs> You're funny. I'm not some glass doll that breaks for being held too tightly. <laughs> oh, I can barely breathe. You were great fun. They're so gay. You're smiling. Oh my Did god. Did I are... make you happy? This is good. <laughs> ah. Don't you find me weird? She's blushing! Oh my god, it's happening! My attitude changes so rapidly. She's bipolar. I've been <laughs> to you for a long time, and all of a sudden I start to follow you around and try to use you to survive from this. Weird? What's so bad about that? Even if you're weird, it's a good kind of weird. I like you. Staying by my side. 
Even if I'm a benefit-driven fence-sitter who immediately embraced Arcanist after being ditched by my human friends? Jason and Michael shouldn't hate you, if they knew you better. <sighs> the laughter makes her tired. She lets her body fall on the sofa, her head leaning- OH MY GOD! Really like me. Dude, they're so gay! Like, it's not even- Dude! Like, literally, it's- <laughs> Jesus! Jesus! You would jump off the car to rescue me? You protect me? Praise me? You would even be happy because I was happy. Because I've never seen anyone as pretty as you are. Oh my god. You're special. You're different to the rest of us. Oh, stop. I will not be embarrassed for these nice things you said about me. I've heard enough of them throughout my entire life. Oh my god. Listen, <laughs> I'm very sorry for mistreating you, and I'm grateful that you came to save me. I will reward you with a secret. My secret. Do you want to hear it? Absolutely. Oh god, she killed someone. Anna, uh, Anne's great uh, green eyes are filled with sincerity, shining like a puppy. Uh, I'd love to. In fact, I don't hate horror movies. This is the diary I found in the attic. There were many other things, like a full warehouse. I actually liked them a lot when I was a kid. I spent most of my time here, in Green Lake Campsite, writing my own horror movie scripts on paper. The handwriting is pretty childish, so the writer uh... might be around 8 to 13 years old. Some of the narratives are straightforward, but the story itself is very creative. But later, we moved to another town. <sighs> <sighs> My parents earned great success in business, and we moved into a high-profile community where only humans are allowed. We were also given privileges that Arcanists cannot enjoy. It was then I realized, nobody wants me to be an Arcanist. It was since that day, the diary stopped updating. It might be forgotten or taken away. The story ended there. That's why I decided to break off my connections with Arcanists and stop showing interest in emotive things like horror movies in order to hide the Arcanist side of me. I took out my energy on other things which may ease my mind, like soap operas, new clothes, fashions. People like me this way. They said this is what I'm supposed to do. They believed I'm a dumb bimbo. Believed that I'm a <laughs> She really said bimbo. The life they want me to have. What the hell? Until I graduated from high school. Uh, that's a the strong word to use. Is that like, huh? Or is that just me? <laughs> I don't like these people. You shouldn't have been put through this. You are the smartest person I've ever known. Anna reaches out her hand and clenches a if fist. If one day I run into them, oh God. I will pull their noses and mouths off like this. <laughs> <laughs> a wonderful idea. I wish I was as creative as you are. So, in the end, I attacked one of the jerks who didn't watch his mouth at the prom. I slapped him in the face and smashed four sandwiches and a salad on his head. <laughs> Then, what? feeling resentful for what had happened, I applied for a degree in filmmaking, a course which was considered to be ill-fitted to me, and next I start shooting horror movies for an assignment I have to finish. <sighs> Deep down inside, I think I have never really given them up. I've probably never stopped loving them. Keep on shooting. I will buy you a new camera. Hello? Have you been eavesdropping? Where's your manners? Actually, I heard them all as well. Everyone heard them. You were being gay, like, very obviously, in so the middle of the I. room. We are in the same room. <laughs> you can talk. Yeah, you right. Hear, and the air helps. That's it. Well, we are all here, paying attention to your voices. We heard everything you just said. You're gay. Tooth Fairy walks up, gently putting a pink diary on Blonde's knees. 
I think this is yours. Mm -hmm. Now I should hand it back to you. Where did you find it? I haven't seen this for a really long time. A reunion after a long separation. Blonnie opens the diary carefully. I used to do some arcanist tricks with it, but I have lost control over my power since I threw it into the l huh? 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 Blonnie suddenly gives a shiver, perhaps because she is touched by the diary, or perhaps because of something else. She raises her head and looks around. Aren't you guys cold? How come it's so chilly? Um, huh? <laughs> um... A gust of cold wind along with a bit of rain swirls into the cabin. Outside the open door, a wedding ring lies in a puddle, reflecting light ominously. That ring? Wasn't it on my finger a minute ago? Yeah, we saw that in the image, right? Watch out. Something is approaching. Oh, no. So Netherana could be us, timekeeper. <laughs> it's true. It's true. Uh, let's see. Mm. Anyone offer your seat? To the oh senior? boy, there she is. It's the it's the bloodborn the bloodborn bride uh, scary Take it easy oh, that's the idea. my child here's something fun for you Break it break it The two fair is a small burb yeah How She's dare a you. tiny burb oh, I Handle it gently. The party star. Hey. The story begins with a battle dog. Who did this first? At last. Ay 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 ay. The debuffs. I believe in you. <laughs> the ocean dried and I'm alone again. <laughs> it's alright. I know the moon, and this is an alien city. Uh, well, don't be so hard. Let's find balloon cleanses too. Take it easy. I believe in you. Flying handbag for only 3,000 Fibonacci's. So long lives this, and this gives power to thee. Depict the world I Handle have never it seen My sword sharp. Each moment, now night. Got wrecked. My child, here's something fun for you. Lenia Sereno intenso ad infinito. It's alright. I believe 
Where's the party star? Where is it? Handle it gently. Sempre caro mi tu questa bocola. The story begins with a bad adult who did this first. In fact, at last. Flying handbag for only three thousand paper dancies. Why is she so tanky? Stop being tanky. World I have never seen. I believe in you. So that's your idea. Each moment, now night. I know the moon, and this is an alien city. <laughs> How welcoming! gonna do the thing yes she did the thing let's go uh slip worn on a groom's chest so touching so sentimental so moving it's time to say goodbye don't miss me Cute. i'll be back she's so scared <laughs> This is a good chance that... <sighs> She's smelling a skunk in the sewer. Ew. Bloody! The ghost bride took her down. We need to help her. Not good. The critters are coming around again. <sighs> um... The ghost bride murmurs something and crawls over Blonnie, who has fallen to the ground. I do. Do. I do. Hey, Blondie, if you want to survive, leave that ring alone! Hell, you think I wanted this? This crazy woman ghost put it on me! Get off! You're lost! The ghost bride's oozy body is kicked back several feet. <sighs> Blondie quickly struggles to her feet and runs toward the back of the cabin. Shaking her head, Tooth Fairy walks to the center of the monster. She's gonna fuck them up. Hi, Bernard! Thank you for the hydrate and the stretch. Thank you. And I wonder how much gain this will Verdon see through your entire adventure. I know, right? Just when I kind of make his Verdon, and I would be surprised. I mean, yeah, the game is very unapologetically, um, you know, supportive. Yeah. <laughs> How you doing, Renaud? How's it going? She's surrounded by sparkling powder. What they need is a song. Oh, here we go. This is Miss Tooth Fairy singing. Miss Tooth Fairy, behind you. Jeez, uh, what the fuck? What is that? Um... <laughs> what is it, do you think? Of course! A good surprise! Huh. I didn't know I was what? a talented driver. What the fuck is that? Why does the car have a mouth? Once we get out of here, I'm gonna get myself a driver's license. Within 30 seconds, you crashed over every critter in our sight. I don't think you were qualified to be a driver. I mean... No, no, that's not the point. Where did you get the car? Pink Mines. This is drawn with an oil paint pen. This is her arcane skill. Oh, what? Your arcane skill restored pretty fast. Seems like you've accepted your identity. Maybe that, or maybe because I retrieved this diary. I feel something has changed inside me, making me a bit hyped. 
A good try. Please keep up with the feeling. That song you just sang. Can I take it as a gift? You mean... Well, you still owe me a song. Please, I want a song for you. Sure, take it as a gift. For making progress in life. And for your courage to embrace who you truly are. Thanks. This is my handkerchief. Take it, wipe your face. Ah! The hummer woven with pink graffiti ho What? Horns and melts in the rain. Blonnie stumbles backward. It's a misjudgment of her own arcane ability, a mistake commonly made by rookie arcanists. Did you just get a bit woozy from putting up a big scene to the rescue? I didn't! Okay, uh-huh, yeah, mm-hmm. What are you doing? He's I know the rules of social courtesy. You just saved my life, so I won't embarrass you by telling others you just overestimated your ability. Horopedia shakes his hand, a grin spreading across his face. If you are willing to take advice from me, I would say don't overburden yourself. <laughs> Enjoying a chill Saturday? Let's go. Let's go. Blonnie is powerful now? I mean, I guess. A uh, slip wrap between the fingers of a bride. So ruthless, so cruel, so frightening. Bum, bum, ba -dum, bum, bum, bum. Didn't she get what she wanted on uh, Black Friday? Mm, the gentle girl's tears stream down her face, the person in her heart concealing a sharp knife. A silver hoop made for a ring, a hemp rope made for a collar. The sparkling light shines and she falls into the mirror. Uh, the allergy in the white rose, a wooden box buried six feet under the groom's ten fingers ring ring tears from a white handkerchief his beloved awakens in the dead of every night so this is the bride that got killed is that it am i getting that right something something and we got more to level up let's go yippee is there anything else now yeah this Worn teeth and old marks. Uh, so this is like her story, I guess? Oh. Ooh. Hi, Pwn Pwn Kong. Welcome in, welcome in. What is this? Safety guide, please read the safety handbook carefully. Whether the rumors of Green Lake brought you as far as not even come across, more mysterious than this. What? How are you doing, Pwn? How's it going? Uh, uh, please keep mark points from the handbook, review them as much as possible. After all, it never hurts to be prepared. One training session will be unlocked each day. Each training session is a normal and a hard mode. Complete normal training sessions to unlock hard ones. After entering the training session, you can try the character provided for the event. Oh. Complete the training objective to receive a reward. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Okay. Combat puzzles like the, yeah, like the tutorials. Who is this? Oh, welcome, why, sir? What? Why do you have a little flow flower with a? What is it? What is that? What am I? What am I looking at? What am I looking at? She has like a little. What is that? A flower with a face? A comment post your favorite. I mean, it's a ghost. No, no, no. That that that's something terrifying. Um, so these are all... Oh, look at her. Mm -hmm. Can I help you? No. Sorry. Anyone else? Oh, you. <laughs> Who are mm -hmm. you? Are oh. you okay? I just passed out. There's I a cute dog see. here. Take the notebook on the desk and write down what I said. They're very gender. I can already see that. Um, oh, and her. Oh, I think she's cute. Finally made up your mind to share some secrets no. with me. No, 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 Grab no, no. Those. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. 
Interesting, but yeah, no, thank you. Not today, not today. Second best healer and non-binary. Wow, I I'm so good at spotting. <laughs> I am. Um, I I felt it. I felt it. You know. I uh, we're good for today though. I think. Uh, how many? How but but how many like main story quests is there? Wait, what is this? Can I buy stuff from this? A sheep! Oh wait, I could. Oh <gasps> wait, is this? Oh my god, this is a. Um, Baby blues thingy. After a carry, use a debuff incantation to carry this healing rate increased by 3%. This effect can stack up to four times. Uh huh, uh huh. Increased carry's critical rate by 7%. Is this for si for fairy? Yeah, signature for fairy. Yeah. Oh, that's really cool. 18? Alright. Alright, alright, alright. That's so cool! I want that. I need that. Oh, and you can get the. Oh! You can get this stuff for the event things? Okay, that's really cool. Um, I'll save up then. I'll save up then. Bum, 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 bum. Um. I. Same as last event. I don't think I exchanged anything last event. I, d I didn't even see that. I didn't even care enough to like check that out. <laughs> and see the shop. Um, let's see. Uh, bum, bum. What's in here? Why is it showing me an icon, huh? Why are you showing me an icon? Oh, because it's at 100%. Alright. Claim it. I'm fine with it. Claim it all. She's so chill. Um, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. You can get all if you burn stamina on boss at the end. In the end, on max difficulty for two weeks. Uh, okay, okay. I guess. As long as I get, like, the, you know, the important big things, I guess. Uh, that's kind of- I don't need every single thing. Right? Mm. I'm gonna clean shop as per usual. I should have checked the shop last time because I I didn't I didn't really I don't know I just didn't vibe with the event <laughs> I just didn't vibe with it that's literally all dragon tired always um Alright, I'm gonna send you- I'm gonna send you to Kurumiya. I'm gonna send you- I'm gonna send you to- It's a- um, They're doing a subathon for charity. They're currently looking at cats. They're looking at cats. That is- That- That is all you need to know. <laughs> that is the only important thing. I don't know what else they're doing. But it's a charity- It's a charity subathon. They're 33 hours and 35 minutes. Let's go. Um, but yes, they they probably tell you all about it when you're there. So I don't have any I don't have any insider information, but I'm probably gonna tell you. <laughs> so yes, thank you very much for joining. Um, we don't have anything tomorrow. I think I am helping people tomorrow with stuff. Maybe I think. Ooh, again, I think I don't know. <laughs> But then we're not gonna stream that. Um, but yes, thank you very much for joining today. The next of uh, like officially planned stream is going to be Wednesday. It's going to be our reclears for tea again, uh, which hopefully we can get four. I think four, four more kills, which would mean then uh, we have all the all the kills. Like then I'll have all the weapons, which would be really cool. So yeah, gonna gonna try for that. That'd be really nice. Otherwise, I'd go into Party Finder and just get them. But yeah, um, I'll make a schedule. You'll find it as always in Discord or down below in the schedule section. And uh, I'll see you whenever I'm back. Yeah. Have a good one. Have fun. Stay safe. Goodbye.